let's get to that Mass Effect shenanigans chat. Boom! Very excited. There we go. Did I miss the erotic Shrek fiction? Yeah, sadly, you did, Austin. Welcome back, though. We just finished a review a couple minutes ago. Getting into some Mass Effect right here. Oh, we just played Pharaoh. Should we did we did Zeus Hope or Zeus Hope or whatever it's called. Zeus Hope. God. OG Chair deserves better justice for OG Chair. OG Chair is dead. Well, actually, OG Chair. Well, OG Chair still exists. Just does the erotic Sonic <laughs> things. Now she has a sitcom going right now. Wow, the normal suburban dad. I'm shocked. There was erotic Shrek fic? You missed it, Naya. You missed Actually, no. <laughs> there was always a lot of eroticism in Shrek. I gotta do some erotic fan fiction of Shrek, though. That has inspired me, chap. I'll find some. I'll find some tomorrow. I'll read some erotic, so or excuse me, some erotic Shrek fan fiction. Some dirty erotic Shrek fan fiction, chat. I'll read some tomorrow, and I'll post some on my OnlyFans. That's what I'll do. Shrek is love. Shrek is life. Oh, no, need with a $5 donation. No name woman, big trouble in little China. Thank you. Oh, for the $5 for some good vibes and the continuation of my FF9 propaganda. I'll allow it. I'll allow it. I, I will be reviewing, by the way. Speaking of uh, Fast Fears 9, family. No thank you again for the five dollars. I will be reviewing all of the Fast and Furious films uh, in the month of June, starting with one chat, doing also the spinoff uh, Hobbs and Shaw, uh, in uh, leading up to chat the release of F9. I'll also be doing full length video and audio commentaries of the films. Those will be released as bonus video and audio commentaries. Chat the two dollar tier level, the entire Fast Saga, chat at least uh, as of this point. It'll be fun. It'll be really really good. Anyway, oh yeah, how are you guys doing? Ships are already on their way here with Hell yeah, let's get the fuck out of here. Let's leave. Oh yeah, does she talk to me anymore? I she will does. Do what I can to assist the colony in this difficult time. Oh, I gotta change this to Mass Effect. Hold on. Ashamed of the damage done to the lives. You should people. be ashamed. She's gonna pay for it for the next two games, <laughs> which I think is quite funny. Whip. Yeah, if you don't, oh, oh, is Torque count? Is Torque part of it? I didn't know. Uh, oh yeah, I already asked for all this. Farewell, Shiala. Bye, Shiala. Farewell, Commander. I wish you well in your Goddamn home. right. Rex is blocking the camera chat. Space Dad. Or the Space Slug, as uh, Carmi Hazel calls him. Oh yeah, Ledger, how you doing, buddy? I never thought I would be so thrilled to see a soldier. Forgive my previous inaction, but under the Thorian's influence... You're good, Frog Boy. It's okay, buddy. Hilted. Made OG cheer into a whore. No, I didn't. <laughs> No, I didn't. <laughs> what will you do now that the fighting is over? <laughs> I may stay. Try to recover my losses. Doing tricks on the street. <laughs> Perhaps the colony will survive after Oh, my lord. <laughs> Let me see what you have in stock. Of course. Return in the future and Doug I may have more to see. Uh, he, does, he does some voice work, doesn't he? I don't think he voices this character. Uh, is this better? Hold on. Not as good as what I have, chat. I got a lot of shit to sell you, sir. Actually, you know what? You're here. Let me see what you have. I'm going to sell you a whole bunch of crap that I just got to get rid of. I got way too much shit here, chat. Oh, my God. I got way too much. Chris, here's a good five biddies. I'm going to read your comment just a second. I just, I got to get rid of some of this. <laughs> I have to get rid of all of this. Oh, I'll mark you. I'll mark you. Um... You, I suppose. I'll keep that one. That looks good. Jesus. Oh, pro get all, all the proton rounds. Proton rounds, get out of here. Don't need you, don't wanna. Shredder rounds. I don't really use them any shredder rounds. I mean, it's good against organics, but I use the other kind. Uh, I'll keep the tug instead. Making that money. Thank you, Christian. Uh, by the way, regarding turtles and the look, I feel like they're saving all the extra colors for the Bollywood scenes with Kamala and Johnny. 
guilties of trailer in the outer space stuff, especially since Zhao said the movie's love letter Jack resigned. Love over here. Well, that's good. They didn't show in the trailer, though. You only want her when you need her. <laughs> For the eroticism, yes. Obviously. <laughs> For the erotic sonic fan fiction. No question. Finally, that damn thing is out of my head. I think all these people just say the fucking same pain. thing. And with the power cells you brought, I can get this place up and God damn again. right. Thanks, Commander. You're fucking welcome. All right, bye. How oh, we can get out of here? Let's go. Let's go back to my ship. Well, so we're going to head back to the... Oh, shit. No, we're going to head back to the Citadel. And see if I can buy any Spectre gear. Because if I can buy some Spectre gear, Chad, that would be fucking amazing. Wouldn't mind that right now. I have the money to buy it, too. Is there space pro paying? Is space pro paying session message? Yes! I was trying to give some to the colonists, but they were like... No. They don't want it. Where the fuck am I going? Oh, there we go. What the hell? What? Oh. Got it! We're good! Ben Thanos is a tight... Titan Eternal, an eternal demon hybrid. His parents aren't purple and has a brother named Star Fox. Alright. Fair enough, Jeff. Oh, shit. Did I miss something right here? Oh, it's Tali. Tali's like, I'm not an item. I'm sorry, Tali. I know. Well, she is an item, but... Not the way I thought. Let's go oh, by the way, I learned something today. Apparently, uh, Bioware released some, uh... Some stats of the Mass Effect Legendary Edition. Tali... Is the most one of the is the most popular squad mate in the game. She has taken out the most in Mass Effect One, Two, and Three out of all the other squad mates. Which I think is really fucking cool. I was like, God damn right you are, girl. God damn right she is, chat. She is space waifu. Sure of course she is. Decontamination in progress. Commander, mm -hmm. you look pale. Are you suffering any? It's my Ill natural skin color. She got a, well, she's cutie. She got a big old booty, no doubt about. It. She got them hips. The cipher shook me up a bit. Lately, I use her all the time. She's I great. She's got great personality, I'm useful in combat. If I join my consciousness <laughs> yeah, PCs, you yours, can get your costumes from the Star Wars Republic Public Department. Yeah. <laughs> Go ahead. Do it. Go right. inside me, Liara, in a non-sexual way. In a non-sexual way. Embrace eternity. Relax, Commander. Embrace eternity. Oh! <laughs> oh! There's some weird shit happening. I'm a color Oh, yeah, Talia's best girl. You don't even see her face. She is a, a, a lot. It's a lot about her character, exactly. Exactly. The reason why I fell in love with her, the reason why I wanted her to be my romance, is because it's her character, chat. Not her looks. I mean, she's got a big butt. Other than that, other than the big booty, she's great. <laughs> Come here, so my present crash. What did I miss? No, oh, you're good. Uh, Liara went inside me. What you have seen would have she went inside me and she pulled out a whole line. bunch of weird Come shit. On, get to the point. What did you God, actually does not like the Liara? On Eden Prime must it's like, alright, fuck, get to the point. Damaged. Warning, bright flashing Large lights. Parts of the vision are Zylon, <laughs> thank you for the host. The thank you, welcome to stream, Zylon. Hope you're doing very well. Pleasure to see you. So there was nothing you sure you didn't fucking useful? Are you kidding me? Jesus fucking Christ. Liara, what the fuck? You already know. You were right about the Reapers. God damn right I was. The Protheans were destroyed by a race of sentient machines. No one believes me. I think it is obvious there is a connection between the oh, Reapers, got that the Protheans extinction, <laughs> and the Conduit. Chocolate. But I did not see anything here. that would help us find it. Now what? What's our next move? I was able uh, to we're make the, the data relayed We're going to do some side missions. What was there at least? And we're going to go to Vermeer. But something was missing. That was one hell of a way to pop it. She went inside me. It's true, though. He found Who can leader. her skin if look... Can how can her skin look shiny and dry at the same time? <laughs> That's not... It's not dry up there. I'm That's sorry. just a pattern. That's a pattern. Is exhausting. She's like, Shepard, I, I, I feel faint. I have the vapors. Are you okay? Dr. Chakwas should take a look at you. God damn right. That will not be necessary. <laughs> She's I got like an ashy head. Somewhere quiet. Uh, it didn't tire me out. I mean, I'm fucking fine. Are you sure it was the joining? I feel fine. Your Are you having the woman vapors? Is that what I'm it is? No, I'm good. Myself I just work out. All right, what a nice. Drown myself in very, very nice. Thoughts. It is more difficult than it looks. The human subconscious instinctively resists the joining, Commander. A strong personality like yours. Hell yeah, I got a lot of personality in here, Trap Corhub. We're done here. So the minute they over here say my baby Lara A S she y'all try I know I didn't say that sixteen, but I didn't say that. No. 
Ah, fuck, patch them through. Patch them through, Joker. Patch them. Setting up the link now, Commander. Beep bop, beep boop. Commander, Exogenia should have told us about the thorn. Goddamn right, they should have. Much easier. You might have been able to capture it for study instead of destroying. Fuck it. The Thorian liked to enslave mine. Yeah, it was a piece of shit. Anyone who studied it would have ended up as a slave. It's chat. Perhaps it's for the best then. At least the colony was saved. That's right. Of course it was saved. Shepard would go to any lengths to help. All right, this guy's such a fucking asshole to me. What did I do to him? Here's your thing with my buddy. Shepard's had the demolition man sex. He did. <laughs> that's exactly what that is. That is what. Yeah, that's what it is. You nailed it. That. Ooh. Not. We we can't share our fluids. <laughs> that's not how a sorry sex works. Can't be the sharing of fluids. Her eyebrows are very 90s, early 2000s. Very, very thin. <laughs> I didn't notice. Being human. Had Next time I look at Liara, I'll check it out. They were I gotta talk to her in a bit. Admirable. But sometimes specters have to make sacrifices. Oh, shit. I hope you're willing to do that when the time comes. All right, this guy's Goodbye, setting something up. Take it easy. We will be waiting for your next report. By the way, Chet, you're going to be able to decide the fate of two of my squad mates. Probably this stream. I'm going to let you vote. I'm going to let you vote, chat. It'll be fun. <laughs> uh, oh, yeah, I got to talk to everybody. Uh, let me go talk to Joker. Get his opinion on the mission, chat. Seth Green. Keep it Larry. Lucy Juicy, master of the Batoots. Welcome to be Larry. How you doing? Uh, hey, Commander. Next time we touch down, let's try not to park Ashley. the ship in a colony. Should, should I kill the zombies? boring guy or the space racist? <laughs> Which one? <laughs> I have to go. All right. See ya. Oh, Lord. Athena Thousand. Who's Athena in the movie? It's a good ship design. Normandy is a uh, quality craft, my friend. At Normandy SR2 is better, though. I like Normandy SR1. I like Normandy SR1 fine. And SR2, that's where the personality is. Hazel, so what is this? What's this link that you just sent? <laughs> Gwen Stefani eyebrows. Oh, oh, yeah, she has those. You're right. <laughs> you're right, Naya. Naya, when you're right, you're right. <laughs> Racism in space, space, space. Yeah, it's, you, 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 yeah you're not wrong. <laughs> she does have those. Oh, Angela Jolo's character? Gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. I, I, I don't know who any of the yes, characters Commander? are. Is there something you need? Sorry. I should go. Goodbye. You should kill the biotic dude. <laughs> Caden. Yeah, and Caden was also the least least uh, popular squad mate. I feel bad for the actor because he does a good job. Like, the two human squad mates are always, like, the least popular ones. Everyone goes to the aliens, which I totally understand. They are really cool and interesting. All right, here he is. Yep, she, you're right, Naya. She does have the she does have those eyebrows. Those are the eyebrows. Commander, are you coming to check I up on me? I was worried. You look much better. How are you feeling? The pencil brows. Yeah. Doctor Chakwas assures me I am going to be fine. I was impressed. So like he was born. He is. I agree with physiology. you. He's not very interesting. So you get to choose between him or Ashley later on, chat. Leave it up to you guys. She's the best. You're in good hands. Dr. Chakwas knows what she's doing. Amazing. Hashtag call me I Brown. get the feeling you want to ask me something. I like Miranda. Commander. She's a nice queen. I like her. Nothing important. I just wanted to talk, talk about you. Of course, Shepard. What did you want to talk about? Oh, yeah. I guess they're all the uh, the uh, things are done with them. All right, bye. I should go. I should go. Goodbye, Shepard. All right, bye. Yeah, I think we're pretty much done with the squad mates with their conversation. At least until Vermeer. At least until Vermeer, chat. Caden. Speaking of Caden, those eyebrows made of hair surely has no hair. Oh, that's a good question. I think they are made of hair. Yes. Anything you need, Commander? Looking for personal input. Just trying to get a sense of where the crew's at. Thought did I pull a coming brownie? I probably did. Duration. I probably you did. Count on everyone to do their duty. Yes. Uh, talking to someone. What's your opinion on the last? Mission? Said nine brownie four times and even though it's. Oh damn it! <laughs> I don't know why. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I don't know why I do what you do. I'll go for all the activities. His eyebrows remind me of my uh, Cholatia's tattooed on eyebrows. Oh, what? What is that? Where it's just like a line, like a tattoo line. <laughs> Invest in some eyebrow sculpting. <laughs> That's what she needs to do. Take, I'm taking responsibility. I'm sorry. I'm taking responsibility for it. I didn't know. <laughs> oh, we'll no. Time, Lieutenant. 
Brownie blap blap blap. <laughs> oh no. It's not intentional. I I just I I don't I don't I don't know why I confuse. I'll never understand it. We want prayer hands. Chat. I'll give you the sexy Sonic scene. Chat. Naya, call me Hazel. I take responsibility. There you go. <laughs> I will never understand why I I constantly confuse you two in the chat. I don't get it. Your names aren't even the same. <laughs> ah. You know I mean well. <laughs> now do that every time. I have to now. Lord. Oh, yeah, I think Rex still tells me a little adventures, though. Never a dull moment with you, Shepard. Goddamn right. Uh, tell me about a uh, personal inquiry. Do you ever go on any missions like ours before? Saving the galaxy from certain destruction? Uh, no. No. But I've had my share of adventure. Maybe it's because they have certain cadences in the comments. I think that might be it. Maybe that's it. The cadence of their of their comments. Mm hmm McCoy, I'm confused people in the chat. <laughs> Tell me about your adventures, Rex. Do you Papa Rex. Any that stick out? Is it Klingon a type? Few. Yeah. I would say I yeah. The Krogan are very similar to Klingons. They're like a they're like aggressive that. warlike species. What an ass. What was the map? I guess even politics. The roly poly shit. Question. The roly polies. Uh -huh. Romance of the Krogan. I <laughs> mean, the Krogan. <laughs> if it wasn't the politician, uh, I'd be out of work. Well, we have a lot of females who look the boss. We got a lot of we got a lot of girls. We got a lot of girls in the chat. Was no different. I have a. I actually have a surprisingly uh, uh, a, a lot of um, female viewers. Huh. I think it's awesome. His old friend. They have a diverse community chat. Ouch. So interesting, chat. It's a sorry commando we, uh, he references what? here. Actually no. turns out to be Arya Talok in, in Mass Effect friends. 2 and 3. Sort of. Because she also references Rex. We met when we were both contracted I think it was pretty goddamn cool. Krogans have no eyebrows. They're basically the like giant... They're like frog turtle dinosaurs. More time fighting each other Mojo Jojo, no! Uh, she was a merc. An Asari commando mercenary? That's unusual, isn't it? Mm. I wouldn't say it's unusual. Mercs come in all shit. Didn't mean to assume. Sorry, Rex. Hey, Space Turtle, how's anyway, Grandpa Bulba? Baba, Baba, sir. The, the best Gen 1 star, chap, Bulbasaur. When I do uh, Leaf Green, when I do uh, um, uh, Pokemon Leaf Green someday, I'm going to uh, choose Bulbasaur, chap. So what did you do? Oh, so well, my rival will either be called I the chat or will be called Naya contract. Brown. But I because actually, it probably will be called Nye Brownie, just because the, the she end, always said, "Smell you later." So I feel like I'd have fun. to call my first rival Nye Brownie. She chose some old Solarian space station overrun with. Murk He's like the damn nice it is. Not the mama. Not the mama. Didn't have to worry about hurting Hi, space slug. He <laughs> <laughs> always was a bit of a softy. About the fight. What happened on the station? That's cool. What didn't happen? For two days, I chased her through that story. I got some. I do. My entire store it's a ammunition. melting pot, if you will. I like I to consider it a melting pot of people. Crap weapons. By the third day, the station was barely holding together. The I'm like a thick northern accent. Like mine? <laughs> Not my Steve doesn't make People like different I things. People like different she things. In the now, I like Bayou Crit now. They like Bayou Crit. They love Bayou Crit a lot now. <laughs> Love you, Chad. You guys seem like cool dudes. No, you won't. It's, 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 it's yes, you know you won't. Yeah, obviously it won't. <laughs> Barely made it back to my ship in time. Humana, humana, gym leader Brownie is blasted off again. Dang. <laughs> I assume the yeah, Lena, I think, is actually a um, uh, uh, Aria to Loke. From a distance. I never saw her leave. She's had many and names. That place blew. There was nothing left larger than a Turian's right nut. Never watched Master. You know, I've actually oh, I've never I seen Master of None. Heard it's a good show news, though. Collect my pay. But before I got half, you know, it's nice though. He's got the big like uh, uh, shell on his back. You're right. He's got a hump. Next He's got a hump. <laughs> oh, she survived. Now, I'm not superstitious. I see that, call me Hazel. But if someone can survive Space that, man. well, they deserve. Okay, woo wooey. And the Volus? What about the diplomat? He wanted her dead. I told him the truth. Oh, shit. <laughs> well, he 
Athena was still alive and she was. Hey, I'm proud. Of course. I told him if he wanted to live, he'd need me around to protect him. Oh shit, Cagey. You're smarter than you look, Rex. I <laughs> <laughs> like that. He kept me on as his personal guard until he died. Goddamn Natural right. Causes. Mm -hmm. Sure. <laughs> Easiest job I've ever had. A little boring, but credits are credits. That's a goddamn good story. So long, Rex. Shepard. Shepard. Thank you, Rex. Okay, I gotta equip my uh, characters of some better weapons. We'll go to Tali for now. Go to the Talster. Uh, let's see what shotguns. Do I have any better shotguns for her? I think I have the most powerful shotgun for her right now, so I'm pretty good with that. Uh, sorry, pistol. We got a pistol. I think we're pretty good on pistols right now. I gotta equip some better stuff. Oh, what I will do, though, is plenium rounds, 55 damage is pretty good. Real extension. Ooh, weapon stability, that's not bad. Um, scram rail. Keep that. Oh, we'll get a definitely. Actually, uh. Hold on. Do that one right there. The pistol. Hmm. We'll give you some. Polonium rounds, Tolly. You can add coil. And we'll give you a rail extension. So that's kind of the ones you're rocking right now. What else do you have here, girl? Uh, where's Garrus? Oh, yeah, shit. Uh, Garrus, 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 Garrus locker. Let's see what we can give you, Garrus, buddy. Um, breaker. Crossfire. Crossfire. What's this look like? Tug and stin rounds will give you some uh, polonium rounds, Garrus. Recall that will give you a much better one than that. I'll give you that scram. Actually, no, we'll give you a connect stabilizer. And we'll keep that for now for your sniper. Let's see what we can do here, Garrus. You got Punisher. Punisher. It's a better one. Give you that one. Give you explosive. Ooh, yeah, we'll give you explosive round, Garrus. Uh, optics, max acne. Oh, that's actually that's not bad. Um. And we'll give you the optics too. Oh man, so many good ones here. I gotta give you a better one here, Garrus. Buddy, Boobala. Um, I'll give you that one. And Tolly will give that. Oh, no, that's Rex's locker. Tolly, come here, girl. Tolly, we're gonna give you this one, because this is gonna be really good for you to use in the future. Um, I think that's good for now. Alright, let's go talk to Garrus. See how he's holding up, chap. Already heading out. Already have a fantastic evening. Thank you for stopping by the stream. Hope you enjoyed yourself here. I mean, I want to meet the the guy who scarred Rex. Poof. I think it might have been his dad. And I'd be shocked if it was his dad. Commander, I wanted to thank you. Thank me? What for, Garrus? For everything. Taking me with you. Letting me be part You're of You're welcome, team. lizard bo bird boyfriend. I'm gonna fuck him, way. chap, and uh, when I do my fem chef uh, playthrough, it's gonna be good. About finding the best He's so way handsome. Just the fastest. And I've been thinking He's about a handsome days. man. I convinced myself that he deserved to die, but then I started thinking about why I wanted him. Mm. He's learning, chap. I realized it was becoming a better, uh, more well-rounded person. Part of it, but I think most of it was because he got away. From he made it personal. He, he made it personal. My watch, and I didn't like that. I let it become personal. Very good. I'm glad you see it that way. Keep that in mind when we meet Sarah. Boom. Don't worry, Commander. Hell yeah. Happy to hear it, buddy. Looking for supplies? <laughs> Master X is the kill Krogan. I'd like to. <laughs> Chris Galt goes to fuck everybody. It is. I wish I could. Let's see what you've got. You can't fuck everybody, you bet, chap. Commander. You can fuck a lot of people. Will Bane. Will Bane, okay? Will Bane. It'll happen. It'll happen soon. All right. Uh, you got none for me. Bye bye. We're gonna go to the Citadel, see if I can buy some. Um, oh, do I, can I upgrade? No. We're definitely gonna go to the Citadel, though. Tally, you wanna get anything to say to me, girl? I think she's kinda like, eh. Hey, Shepard. Yeah. Do you need something? Yeah, no, no. I should bye, go. Tally. I should go. One of Shepard's most famous out. lines in anything, apparently. Pretty much. Shepard, he does like the fuck. B uh, male or female, by the way. Uh, sh like, whichever Shepard you play as. They don't play around. They don't care species, race, color, they're like creed, and they're like, let's do it. Let's fucking do it. 
Better fuck a lot of people. Fuck a lot of people. Exactly. I always play Paragon Shepard. Maybe a little bit of Re Renegade mixed in there occasionally. I will do some more Renegade stuff in Mass Effect 2 and 3 because we get these things called Renegade moments where it's like these really badass cool moments. So I'll probably do those in a, in a bit, but for the most part, I play Paragon. I, I can't. I, it's hard for me to be mean to people, especially like to my squad mates. Like I can't do that. I was like, because I, I love them all. I was like, no, I don't want to mistreat them. Can't fuck anybody, can I? <laughs> Let's get out of here, chill. Let's get out of here. Uh, we're, oh yeah, I gotta do this DLC mission too. I think I'll do this DLC, this DLC mission just before Vermeer. Yeah, I forgot about that. We'll go to Citadel. We'll do that DLC mission. Uh, well, I'll do all the side missions, then we'll do the DLC mission. Then we'll do Vermeer. Totally forgot about that. That's like a that DLC is about know, like an hour and a half, two hours. It's called uh, Bring Down the Sky. It's where you see you uh, these Batarian terrorists or the species that hates humanity. They uh, you have this uh, Batarian terrorist who, who takes control of this uh, giant uh, uh, asteroid and is directing it towards this uh, human colony. Kills like like a population of like a hundred thousand or something. Or that's his objective. You got to stop him. Uh, Mass Effect 1 also had another DLC. It was called Pinnacle Station. It was just a horde mode. But that was not included in this collection because the code for it was uh, corrupted. And the only way you can play it now is on the original version. Which I don't, I'm not upset. It wasn't a great DLC. It was just like a... You get extra XP and items and things. But it's just horde missions. I, I was not there. Some people were mad about that. I was like, I didn't care. So are these plans connected to the government like Star Wars? Do they act independently? Um... So they do have a government structure in, in Mass Effect. They you have council races, which is the Turians, the Asari, and the Salarians. They're kind of like the, the the most. They're on top for the other species. Now you do have other species like the Volus and the Elcor and the Hanar and the Drell and stuff. And they all have, have ambassadors and they come there and they ask the council for favors and all that kind of thing. Humanity has one too, uh, but it's all connected. There is like a government. They all act independently, but they're also like, well, we got to play nice, everybody, because you know, they are like, hey, we're gonna be expansionists, but when you have like other species like no you can't don't fucking do that then all these races they have all the treaties and stuff and they'll help whatever race is being abused or something nerd talk me <laughs> come here Hazel stop being a bully you're bullying me stop it <laughs> so they put the DLC in this game cool I finished the uh, DLC of that yeah yeah that was the DLC all the DLC is in in the with the exception pinnacle station all the DLC Love. is in the this commanding game. Officer is ashore. In, in these games, Excellent in this collection. Has the deck. Come here, will be a big time bully. Yeah, like start for the Federation. Exactly. Exactly. Nailed it. After years of poor economic performance, Exogeny has announced that its research company, yeah. Theros, is finally returning a profit. New discoveries. Like you have Starfleet, but Starfleet is part of the Federation. Finally paid Nailed off it. for Exogeny. Very Exo concise Jenny's way to say it. Rose sharply with the announcement. I think Natalia, like, uh, she bounces on her little, uh, feet. So cute. Okay. Me? Never. You're a bully. <laughs> Let me go ahead and see what I can buy. So I wanna, oh, look at, oh, that's right, Garrus. Hey, buddy, I forgot. I didn't take you on Pharos. That's why you can't really do any of the, uh, all these other things. Uh, what's damage? Increase the explosion radius of your tech proximity mine. Shuts down enemy tech about a billion. That's not bad. That's not bad, chat. Woo! Not bad, Garrus. And we'll go ahead and save. <laughs> Come here, night, buddy. I always said call me Hazel. God damn it! Call me Hazel Nye Brownie. I apologize. <laughs> I did it again. <laughs> and I write me as an angel, damn it. I can't help myself. I'm so sorry. Hello, Commander. The Given Soul. Welcome to the stream. How you doing? Show me what you Please have Spectre I'll gear. Now sing Dr. Imagine. <laughs> Enjoy. Uh, oh, he doesn't have any fucking. What the fuck is this? He doesn't have anything, chat. Well, this fucking sucks. Shit. Well. Disappointing. Color me brownie. What a cool pistol. 
See if I got any cool pistols here, Chim. See, I want a pistol that matches. What color is a brawler? A brawler, this is right, cool. I hate it. Other people. Hmm. Whip. All right, so I think is there any other quest? I don't think there's any other quests here on um, the state. I gotta do investigate samples. Gotta do death activities in, in investigate facility. Gotta do the, TL, the DLC, of course. Uh, yeah, I guess I could see Captain Anderson. Go visit him. I can check out some of these other um, markets. See if they have any um, uh, Spectre gear or Colossus armor or something. We'll go to s embassies. Go there. So you hear about the Kevin Spacey shit? No. What's he up to? Do another holiday special? <laughs> What's he up to? I think someone has like, oh yeah, that one Hanar guy has like non-human armors. Maybe I'll find something good there. DT Darkstar heading up, heading out later. Eternal. Oh, oh, bah, bah, bah. Oh, Commander Juice, thank DT Darkstar for a fantastic evening. Thank you for some of the stream. He's making a movie in Italy where he's playing a pedophile hunting detective. Frank Rudeer's Wow. Wow. <laughs> a pedophile hunting detective. Well, he would know, right? <laughs> I saw your Ferris report. If we had known anything about the Thorian, Exogeny would never have been given the permits mm -hmm. to start a colony there. Thanks little tone deaf. So is he going to hunt himself? Have too many it was me the, the whole time. One of our major expansion regions. Dude. You don't give a damn about the colonists. It's all just politics. Terrible, chap. We can't all be the hero who charges in to save the day, Commander. Well, we stop fucking, you know, he's huffing all that goddamn way. silver paint. It's messing with his fucking it head, chat. Politics, it's part of the big picture. Lord. Sometimes it isn't pretty. Dude, check. Just ignore him, Shepard. I am. The ambassador's a little bit. Thank you, Keith David. All right, bye. I got some free Paragon points. All right, let's go talk to some of the merchants here. I might go into the wards as well. So I'm going to see if they have... I need some better armor for my squad mates. Need me on that nickel. <laughs> he really is. I don't know why his lips are like that. I don't remember him being look at least looking that way in the main in the original game. It's very odd. He's very silvery. He's very shiny. What the fuck is going on with him? Oh yeah, I probably just fast travel. Uh, words locations, Presidium locations, Presidium. Go to financial district. Boom. Let's do it. Okay. Talk to his Hanar. Hopefully they'll give me some stuff. <laughs> he looks like a bird victim. <laughs> he looks a little rough. He does look a little rough, double toast. Is, is this, is this? Commander. Is, I wonder who this is, Chef. It is good to see you again. Would you care to see some of its fantastic items? Who is taking on the persona of double toasted today? I'd like to buy something, please. Show me your items. Show me your wares, jellyfish oh, man. This one is pleased you know, if you're, how much so research uh, did you? you how much research did you research get done for this part? Because basically, well, <laughs> right? I'm gonna use some non-human armor. See what this man has. This jellyfish man has, Chad. Uh, <gasps> Colossus armor. Fuck yeah, I'll buy that. How much is this? Ah, oh, it's expensive. It's so fucking expensive. Uh, yeah, I'll buy the hell out of that. Yes. Light armor for Tali? Yeah, I'll buy that too. Well, I don't have any cloth armor for myself, though. That's hilarious. Um. Shit. But isn't, isn't Garrus wearing Guardian? I don't know what, what armor. No, he's wearing Agent armor. That's what he's wearing. Hoo wee Oh, chat. We got some good armor for our squad right now. Let me go to equipment. Uh, Tali. Here you go, girl. Look at those stat changes, chat. But I think she's all red now. Yeah, she has, like, red armor, which is pretty cool. Nice. And I can add an extra upgrade to her. So we'll go ahead and... Let me see what I can... I'll put the best stuff with her. And she has a shield modulator and a combat exoskeleton. Damn, smash. She has all that smash damage now, chat. Uh, ooh. Combat exoskeleton, energized plating, aether damage protection... Uh, we'll give her that one. Let me go to me. I'm gonna get something a little bit better here. I can smash. Do that one right there. I'm gonna go with Garrus, give him something a little bit better too, so I'll be using them for the rest of the game pretty much. 
nice. I got nothing for him. I'm gonna put him on the Phoenix armor. I hate the Phoenix. I hate the way the Phoenix armor looks. Hate it, hate it, hate it, hate it, hate it. All right. Cool. Nice. All right. Romance jelly. I can't. Commander. Sadly, I cannot. See you again. Show me your items. Oh, uh, this let's see one what upgrades you have, fish man. Come exoskeleton. Ooh, that's not bad. Uh, high explosive rounds. Always good to have those. Hammerhead rounds. Nothing for us. High explosive. I don't need any of these. Um, talk to him one more time. See his regular armors. I like to buy Commander. something. Show me your items. Okay, if he oh, must have it, those are not. He might have. He so might have some it. colossus armor. Uh, oh, he doesn't. Got it. Damn it. I'll buy this then. Too bad. All right. Well, some of these guys might have Colossus armor on them. Okay, buy space flamingo. <laughs> What's in the box? <laughs> Love Carmi Hazel's like, hi, space jellyfish, and Nybrand's like, space flamingo. <laughs> Let's go with the wards, chat. See what we got down here. We're gonna go to the markets. So now they're selling Colossus. The Colossus armor is pretty good. Claws armor is some of the best armor you can get in the game. So if I got, like, I can get some of my squad. What, what was the other? Oh, yeah, I bought the claws armor for Rex. We'll definitely go ahead and see if this man's selling any claws armor. Welcome back, Earth Clan. Yes. Will Show me what you've got. Show me. Let me see what you have, sir. Uh, nothing. I hate it already. Shit. All right, let's go down here. Space Jelly Man is the hottest in the game. He's pretty hot. You meet like a the, the most popular actor in Mass Effect is a guy named Blasto. He does the Blasto movies. It's kind of like Die Hard except with a jellyfish. Yes, human. You need something. Sloth yes? Zootopia. <laughs> Raw dog. Have a fantastic evening. Thank you for stopping by the stream. Appreciate you. Shepard, do you ever see Shepard smiles? He's a very creepy smile though. Let me see what you have. He does smile. Well, you will be pleased, I think. When he has the alien sex. You'll see. Uh, let's see if you have a Let's see your non human armor. You're selling Colossus armor already. Uh, Predator, medium armor, Tillers, Titan, Spring, Mantis, Mantis, Duelist, Liberator. Uh, nothing. God damn it. Jellyfish had the best armor so far in the game. Yes, human. You need Let something. me see what else you have, sir. Well, you will be fleet. Hurricane, um, light armor, pistol, striker. This is better. Well, this is better. Uh, God damn! I didn't mean to exit yes, out. Human. Shit! You need something. Yes, all right then. Shut up! Tidings to you, human. Shut up, Frogman. Yes, God human. damn it! Yes, Ow! Goodbye. Hold yes, on. Right okay. Hold on. To you, human. Hold on. Yes, there you go. I did it. You need something. Yes. Go back. I Let will. Me see what you have. Well, you will be pleased, I think. All right. Very see good what else this guy you. has. Oof. Sorry about that, chat. Let me see what. Uh, oh, Geth armor. Oh, I can buy Geth items now. It's pretty funny. Get those a tally. Geth. I think it's like you can get like a Geth assault rifle and shotgun pistol, all that. Alright. I don't think there are any more merchants after that. Yeah, I think I that's it. That's it, chat. So we'll go back to the Normandy. So we finish all the quests here on the Citadel. Oh my god, Shepard's eyes are No, they're not! They're not creepy. Stop it. <laughs> they're fine. They're fine. Oh, the medical. I can go to the med clinic. See if she has any upgrades there. She might. Doctor, what's her name? The French doctor. Commander. I'm coming around. I'm going to have a fantastic evening. Thank you for stopping by the stream. Yes, we got, I got up at 3 4. Oh my god. Get all the rest you need then. Let me take a look at what you have for sale. Good night, Fwin. Ooh, what we got here, chat? Ooh, not bad. Not bad, chat. Got some good. Uh, some good interfaces here. I like it. The give it's all good. It's good. No, uh, today's stream has been amazing. People have been so kind, so supportive. No complaints whatsoever. Reviewed Shrek. Reacted to the uh, Eternals trailer. Uh, been great. Playing Mass Effect. One of my favorite games of all time. One of my favorite trilogies of all time. I'm loving it. I'm loving those gears for a second. I was like, Garrus, why are you walking all fucking funny? Back to the ship. We gotta do some side missions now, Admiral chap. Kahoku, a respected member of oh, the he Alliance did. military, has he passed did, away. Yes, so kind. Yeah. Come Hazel's been a big time bully though. <laughs> 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 Hazel 
Jesus. Died of natural causes. <laughs> it's true. Oh, shit. I shouldn't have done that. Well, I think it, he's like, he leaves behind a wife and like five kids or something. Should have skipped. I just wanted to skip for the hell of it. All right, chat. Let's do some missions. I want to mess with me. Give him some. You and me both, buddy. You and me both. I want a proper Mass Effect Forge continuing the story of Shepard. I think we're getting that. I think that's what Bioware is working on right now. Bioware Edmonton. Oh my gosh, be sure just uh, popped out of nowhere. The commanding officer is aboard. Occasionally pop up. So Presley stands relieved. Yeah, get, get, I love that fucking Presley is the guy that's second in command. You gotta be kidding me. That guy, that fucking jabroni. Unbelievable. All right, chap. Let's see what we got here. Investigate samples. Go to the system. Logs mentioned something about the Matano system and the Maroon, the Maroon Sea Cluster Matano system, chat. Maroon Sea Cluster Matano system. Let's go. We gotta find this Maroon Sea. My Sigma, Argus Row. Mar oh, Maroon Sea, there it is. Whip! There's a lot here, though. There might be some other, like, secret missions here. Check these out in a bit. Matano. Let's go. Like that junk Yeah! It is. No, this 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 game is a very synthy score. Very synth wave score. The sequels, Mass Effect 2 and 3, there's a little bit of synth, but it's mostly orchestral stuff. But I love the synth score. It's so good. Well, the Mass Effect 4 is very long and have a satisfying answer. Me too. I'm right there with you, man. Open. I'm an angel. How dare you? <laughs> I'm just saying, I'm just saying what I'm saying. ENT. There's nothing here. This planet sucks. Scanning, 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 scanning. Oh, knew it. Knew it, chat. Give me that Metallica. Give me that. Give me that metals. 47 kilometers, chat. Metal rich asteroid. Thank you. The score right now is a five. No, it's great. Chaska. Not going to land on Chaska quite yet. Apo. I think there's like one of these planets like a fucking secret somewhere. I'm trying to remember. Alapa. I have to uh, look at my guides and see if I missed any other quest. I probably have. Oh, there it goes. Whip. Five out of five. That's right. That's what Kari and me Hazel meant. Oh shit! What was another one? I thought I missed one. Oh, it was that? Uh, just it was the planet. So, uh, you, Supe, I'll keep finding your savings to six. <laughs> I'll take it. That's positive. All right, uh, Inti, Apo. God damn, what, what's, what plan do I got to land on, chat? Chaska, oh, it's Chaska, that's right. Chaska. Let's go ahead and land, chat. Population 150, small column. Let's do it. Take, uh, gear. Oh, shit. We'll take, uh, garrison top. Confir Squad confirmed. Let's go! Is a bubble gem piece. I think that's like a... Matinee territory? Low matinee territory? I don't know. I'm not sure it would be. Low matinee, I guess. Like, ten's better than sex. Nine, eight is... Is full price. Seven, seven, six to me is matinee. Five, four is rental. And I don't know. It's around there. You gotta put a number on it. Secrets. So many secrets, I don't remember, but did Chris or Double Toast review that movie on Hulu called Boss or something like that? Maybe wrong. No, I don't. I, oh, I, I, I didn't review it. On my, I did not review it on my own channel. I don't know if Double Toast reviewed it. Maybe? I don't know. I don't understand his music. Where's Ed Ba? This is his language, right? Haha, <laughs> beep bop, beep boop. And the beep and the bops and the boops. Hey! Stuck! Oh no! Hold on, I'm gonna try it again. Ha ha! Oh boy. This ain't working. It's Jerry's human music. No, it's better than that! 
You guys are such bullies. Oh, there's uh, minerals over there. Must have your OC. I got him. I have to. Jerry's human music. God, it's hard getting up these goddamn mountains. How the hell am I supposed to get up here? Oh no, it's too hard. Oh no, I'm fall. Oh, I gotta, I gotta reverse. I gotta reverse. Hold on. I think there's like a big time secret over. How the fuck do I get over there? Ah, oh, hell. How do I get up this sheer fucking rock face, Lord? Eh. If I can't fly, <laughs> the game won't let me. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> Wait, no! I fell down. Yeah, this is old school Mako bullshit shenanigans, chat. Hold on, let's go. Eh. Yay! <laughs> I did it. Doing it, chat. There we go. There we go, chat. Is this sort of that super cool thing? No, it's not. I don't know where that glowy thing. I don't know what planet that thing was on. Ooh. Yay! Let's run of gas. Thankfully, no. I need that space propane. Space propane accessories. Got it. Average description. Let's do it, chat. Well, actually, they could pretty much a Mass Effect version of it. I think this temple gives me some stuff. Maybe. Might not. Shepard's already sleepy. Nope. It does not. All right. Let's get going. That is one of the sim uh, uh, is one of the similars that Jerry got stuck. <laughs> <laughs> Who lives here? Why'd you break their home? Oh, it's it's a it's been abandoned. They're probably dead. Probably. Probably, chat. If not, I'll make sure they're fucking dead. All right. Anyway, this way. Not gonna lie, that tank slides are overtrained like a Asylum CGI. <laughs> oh no. It's a little rough. It's a little rough with the uh, the Mako. Not gonna lie. <laughs> Gotta investigate some of this debris. Are you sure? I am sure. Yeah, it's a bit abandoned. Long ago. Oh! Oh no! Oh god. They're every kid. They could be. And I robbed them. <laughs> I promptly robbed them. Of all their worldly possessions. Oh, Jesus Christ. I won't be able to get up here. It's too hard. No, come on. I just got to get a little oomph. A little oomph. Yay. The oomph chat. Oh, yeah. There's minerals over here. I forgot. The manager the latest game. No. <laughs> it's great. I gotta get these minerals. I need them, Chad. I need the money. I need the money, Chad. Let's go and get them. Aha. There it is, the poop. Look at all that poop, Chad. I need it. The big old poop deposit. Or cause no, what have you to learn? <laughs> Does it amuse you? <laughs> <laughs> oh lord. Oh yeah, wait, I guess we gotta get to the debris. That's right. I missed it. We saw the church real guessing they uh kinda like I that's what I'm guessing, Wind Fox. They're like, yeah, they're like very powerful cosmic beings. I assume. Oh looks deserted. Husks. Alright. Yeah, it's dark. It is pretty goddamn dark. Oh, yeah, we gotta go to each location. I guess we'll go here and then we'll go check out that debris. You gotta go inside, Chad. We gotta go inside. 
Firewolf, my favorite wolf, have a fantastic evening. Thank you for some of the stream. Hope you enjoyed yourself. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I have to give props to writers who work on sci-fi projects. They have to come up with different names, worlds, and alien races. That, uh, have a bit, that's true. You gotta be very creative. That's a good point. Your chat. Oh, here they come. Woo! I'll put him down. Where is making that money? I think we got him, Commander. <laughs> no, Juicy. Ooh, ooh, chat, we can get a new subscriber. <laughs> me too well I do do that oh no <laughs> it's true God damn, I gotta, I gotta, too many items gotta sell all this I got I gotta sell this off straight I know I keep saying that I was like I have not done that once <laughs> Ooh, easy decryption beep bop beep boop this is an easy one very easy one chip Ooh, crossfire the crossfire is pretty good that's a good one, Chad. That's a very good one. Oh, I want that. Gimme. Can I get that? I think that's a secret one. Can I? Oh, oh you know. Oh, I, I think I have to get up over there. Maybe? Yeah, I think I gotta go up over there. See what we can do with that. Is this what works? At, yeah, it's like a dungeon. Like, the, this, these, these, this parts of the game is because they reuse it over and over and over again. Which is kind of boring. They improve it in Mass Effect 2 and 3 where they do like actual locations that look different but this is just the same thing over and over and over again i was hoping they would change this up in the legendary edition but they did not it's kind of disappointing i think it would have been cool had they done that but i think I, there's, there's a decryption thing aha all these crates here chat i gotta do it most that most uh, offensive thing robot probably Ooh, some oh, that's nice uh, can I go up here? Oh, there's a thing I missed over there. Nope, can't get it. Alright, never mind. Fair enough, video game. And let me see here. Let me go to my equipment. Oh, a Kalia. That's like really goddamn good. It's better than what I have right now. Oh, it is a better version of what I have. Nice. Nice chat. Uh, Brawler. Actually, I want to go with the car prov. I think the car prov is the one that matches. That does not match. Fuck. All right, well, whatever. Whatever. What about the Razor? Nope. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. Um, accuracy rating. Damage per second. Go with the car prov. Do that for right now. Cool, that, that toaster. Don't like it. Nice. All right, let's go. Went to the same school of walking the left of screen as Leah Cutting. Yep, yeah, that third person, yep. <laughs> classic. It's a classic. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Resident Evil 4 was a very influential uh, game chat when it came to third person shooters. Resident Evil 4 and Gears of War, I'd say. Those have had the biggest impact on the uh, third person shooting games. Third person games in general. Whip. Give me the debris. The debris. Oh, I fucked that one up by accident. Yeah, original one you can. 
Mm-hmm. You can, you can also do in Mass Effect 2, I believe, but those missions are a little, they're, they're structured differently, they're more linear, this is more open. Not a lot to do in these planets, though, it's just kind of, they're very big, but there's just not. They did a, now, I, I, I've seen like a documentary about the production of the original Mass Effect, and they actually intended to have these big open worlds where you can go around and do all sorts of stuff, but they got too big for their britches, chat. Like, they just didn't have time to develop something like that, so they, they kept the worlds, but they just included like these small little quest lines on them. They used the same idea from Andromeda, but it did not work. It did not work. I didn't care for it. Whoop! Let's get inside. Show me what you got. Show me. Oh, more husks. Oh boy, they're coming. They're coming. They're all moving around. Why do they always switch their weapons? I love that. Karis, get your goddamn assault rifle out, buddy. Always over there. You see a shadow. <laughs> Can I open this door? Uh, I cannot. I cannot, chat. Ooh, I can open this crate, though. Gimme. Gang, gang. So we got over here. Anybody? No. <laughs> I am fatigued. Shepard, as we all know, cannot run more than five feet. It exhausts him. It's too much uh, effort on them ham hocks in his shit. Those thick thighs. Those thick shepherd thighs, shit. They're meant for wooing. Bedding and wooing. Not for running. Perimeter secured. I know, girl. Thank you, Tolly. Tolly knows what she's doing, shit. She's smart. I gotta sell more of this crap. I gotta do another one. Oh my god. I got too many items. All right, last one. I have to break some of these down. Yep, now I gotta break some of these down. All right, <laughs> we'll go ahead and get to the equipment here. Any of these as good as what I have? No, any shirt, gains, convener, Salkov. Huh? Salkov's pretty good. Tali, do you have a Salkov? Is that what you have? Ooh, I'll give you an even better one. Do that, and Garrus. Maybe Kolyov, huh? Go ahead and liquidate some of these chat. I gotta get rid of I gotta get rid of them. I gotta get rid of all the thunders. I'm not using the thunders anymore. Uh let me go ahead and Omni Gel. Omni gel. I should go from the bottom here. Omni gel, Omni gel, Omni gel. Alright, let's see how this armor works on Garrus. Yeah, let's want to see what it looks like. So Agent 3. Well, this looks pretty cool. I love that classic blue chat. You know I love that classic blue on Garrus. There's just something about that blue. Can't help myself, chat. It looks good on him. Let's get rid of all of these. Just like nice base cat is Kendall Smooth. Uh, no, he's not. Femshep knows he's not. He's got a lot of stuff working down there. <laughs> I give it so ready for the Evil Dead game come out. I am the given soul. No, I'm very excited for it. 
There are so many cool games coming out this year, and that is definitely one of them I will be playing that on stream chat, no question. I got to check out that uh, that dodgeball game that came out uh, over this uh, past weekend. It's got downloaded today, chat, but I totally forgot, and I got a lot of mess to play. I'll definitely check it out tomorrow, though. I'll have more time. Super excited. All right, let's go over here, go to the last base. I think it's the last base. Escape pod. Did I go with this guy? Yeah, I go with the escape pod. Let's go. I think I went with this guy. Maybe. It's retractable? Definitely. It comes out of him like a dog. That is true. He's Kendall smooth, but then he's like, and it's barbed. It's barbed. Fem Shep knows. Eh. Got it. Said even Final Fantasy is going to have a uh, Souls like. Oh, really? Interesting. That's cool. Hello. Juicy <laughs> voice. No. <laughs> Does he have lipstick? No, he's a guy. I mean, oh, I mean, he, he, I mean, they do have like markings on their face, but uh, I, I don't know. I think that's war. I think that's like that's like I don't know if it's a tattoo or they have to apply it. I don't know what what what, what, what do you consider it? Nothing. Does count as Metal Gear Souls uh game? Uh, I I never really thought of it as a Souls game. I mean, it's definitely a hack and slash. Something more akin to, like, God of War. Or Dante's Inferno or Devil May Cry. That's kind of, I've always looked at that, that game. Oh, boy. Oh, jeez. Okay, here we go. Garrus, that's a wall. Garrus, buddy, that's a wall. It's not, uh... It's not husks, but okay. He's trying. He's trying, chat. He means well. Oh, we're behind him. Two more of these jabronis, Chad. Oh, boy. Got him! Woo, they're popping! Yes. Getting the XP, making that money. Goddamn right, it's all clear. I'm sure the devil shed a tear or two. <laughs> so the guy likes his <laughs> nicket meals. He, um... Oh, you mean Odina? Yeah, I, I don't know why he looks that way. That's part of the uh, remaster. Cause they put new shading and it looks like they put the lighting and shading is all different like most of it looks good but um i will i will agree that udina he looks like he just fucking huffs chrome all day <laughs> like those guys from mad, mad max fury road it's like uh, we you know we live we die we live again it looks like one of those guys witness me it looks like one of those but um uh anderson doesn't look like a burn victim i will agree with that too <laughs> yeah i think Aspect 2 is my overall favorite same same nick I really enjoyed going soldier and using the fire ammo. Oh, yeah, man. Now, I was always about that incendiary. Never like cryo ammo. Always about that incendiary ammo. It was the most optimum because it did extra damage to armor and organ. Yep. Same. I never I never went cryo. Wasn't it like warp ammo, too? I never used that one. I always went incendiary ammo. That was my... Uh, incendiary ammo, and I think it was the... One, the, the uh, was it ion ammo? The one that does extra damage to robots. Those were the two ones I always specialized in. The other ones, I was like, who cares? Is Bat Boy related to Batman? Yes. Yes. Oh, actually, I'm going to go over here first. Bat Boy. They're going to see the table had the balls put the word uh, high uh, rules. Uh, so they have like a, um, what, what's, what the, why does this room exist? Why is this room here? It's, oh, oh it's empty. <laughs> I don't get this. Um, they have like a Dynasty Warriors-esque uh, high rule game. That boy's Mexican vampire man. <laughs> so, striker, etc., etc., etc. I'm a Colossus armor. That's what I want. Glad we get at least. I'm glad at least we're getting Colossus ammo. Oh no, no, no. That is really good to know. I want some Colossus ammo for. Uh, well, definitely Shepard and Garrus at this point. Got it for Tali, which is really, really cool. 
Thought that'd be like one of the harder ones to get for like your alien companions. I thought, well, I'll get it first, and everyone else will be hard. But that was neat that um we got off of the tallster for the space waifu. Clone well, Pioneer team really uh really consists more than a few dozen specialists. It's clear that none of them have survived. The service group has a lot to answer for here. Boom. And I think uh we completed that quest. Yeah, Colony of the Dead. They're all it was zombie, it was a zombie mission, chat. They're all dead. Geth activity. Now I gotta do this super long quest line, which is investigate the Geth. Which takes a while. Uh, but it's also related to Tali's mission. Oh, what's this? I think that's it, okay. Let's close it. Massive 3 multiplayer, that was fun. Uh, looks like it might be actually coming to Legendary Edition. There, uh, I don't know, there were some, like, postings before. I was like, looks like it's gonna actually happen. Does have been teasing Metroid new game for... Ah, well, you know, didn't they restart development, though, of Metroid Prime 4, I believe? I believe, I thought they restarted it. I think they put out a press release, like, a year and a half ago or something. It was a long time ago. That's why it's taken so long. Why is Robin not named Batboy? Wouldn't it make better, uh, make better sense to be called Batboy because of Batman? I think maybe Robin wanted to be called Robin because he wanted to be called Bat Boy. <laughs> Perhaps he's like, I want to be. I'm, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm not a boy. I'm a man. I'm Robin. Maybe. I don't know. It's a good question. There's been a Bat Boy in the comics. I feel like there has been. Maybe. I don't know. Go back to Normandy, chap. Boom. Rob man. <laughs> well, I'm not a Rob man. I'm a Rob man. <laughs> Nice. Okay, we're gonna go. How's my squad? How, many, how close am I to leveling up again? Very close, actually. Oh, I'll be leveling up. Uh, yeah, I need about yeah, about 10 XP, 10,000 XP. I'll do that. That's no problem. That's no problem at all. Oh, there's man bat. There's a man bat. That's true. There's Batman. There's man bat. Oh shit, I wasn't paying attention. Uh, actually, you know what? Let me zoom out. So there's these other fucking planets here. And I, I I feel like there's other missions on them. There definitely is other missions that you won't just like get if you're playing the game. Like uh, oh oh, that missed me. Wait, have I been here before? Let's see, corner corner. Uh, human corner is calling to magic because that's obviously the interest of the corner because not for us getting distress call. Have I been here before? Oh, I've not. This is new. Interesting. And it was very simple. I love bats. I'm doing uh, uh, and 8189 is August 1st, 19. There you go. Boom. Makes it simple. I've not been here before. That fucking ship is just out there. All right. Interesting. Cornucopia. I guess that's why it's taking so long. They, they started trying. That's why. Yeah, I knew they restarted development not that long ago. I think Resident Evil 4 Remake also restarted development recently, so. Maybe we'll time we see that game. I'm, I'm guessing probably 2023 is when we see it. Ugh, I wish it was next year, but. Board this vessel. And we'll take my go-tos with me. I am very ready for the Cold Tour Remake. I am so, so excited. Asper is making, uh, is developing it. They did the remaster for um, uh, Star Wars Republic Commando, which I still got to play on stream. That'd be fun. I'm gonna put inside me, put inside my tummy. Oh, I'm sorry, my tummy. sure it might be. I think this is like an alternate way you can get this quest. You, you find this fucking ship and like, what the fuck? Yeah, this is an alternate way to get this quest. I remember now. Yeah, and then it tells you about the planet that, that I was just on. That's what it is. You can either find it on Pharaoh, so you can find it here. That's right. That's right. Oh shit! Some damage. 
question in there, chat. Uh, uh, let's get my adrenaline ability. No burst. There we go. Very nice. Oh! oh, oh. There's so many of them. Now he's running on up there. Brave as hell. Here, interesting. Hope I'm not stuck. Damn it! <laughs> Tally move your thick thighs out of the way. Are these sentient machines? They're like zombie machines. Uh, you 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 learned that. Uh, so it seems like the Geth have been experimented on. Actually, they're 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 they've, been, they've just been indoctrinated and they've had all their resources, like you know, their bodily fluids taken out and replaced with machine parts. They're like they're like robo human abominations. They're pretty grody. You see variation of the husks in of different species in Mass Effect uh, Three. Of the, uh, oh, I'm trying to remember uh, the Batarians, the Rachni, uh, the what was it, Krogan, and a whole bunch of them. Yeah, I kind of like the Borg. Yeah, it's a good comparison. I like the Borg. The Reapers turn everyone into the Borgs, except with less humanity, even less humanity than, than, than like the Borgs have. He's already filled up again. Fuck! Oh. Wait, I gotta get this to Rex still. I forgot. Uh, I got your. Oh, yeah, I gotta switch this out too. Um, switch you out, but we'll also get rid of all of you too. Um, Keep that anti Thorian thing. Permanent exits. Get rid of some of these other fucking snipers. I'm not using anymore. Omnigel now, though, chat. Snowblind rounds. Little door that goes whoosh when it opens. Uh, it's the number one thing you must always have. That's true, whoosh. Yep, you're right. Sound design is important. Reapers are assholes. They're still, yeah, well, they were assholes. Beep, bop, beep, boop. Greg Skull, I'll take that. I take it, chat. Don't mind if I do. Yeah, I think this tells you about the planet we were just on. I'm like, oh yeah, you already did it. According to the log files, the ship was out near the Oh, with the Geth word. Never mind. Looks like they found some kind of alien artifact. Uh -huh. They brought it on board, and then and it shits get really, really weird. Shepherd. I brought Tali for this mission. They plotted a course straight into the Perseus Veil. Vale, That's bad. Like they wanted the Geth to find them. They're brainwashed. That artifact must have done something to them. Why else would someone fly into Geth's mm -hmm. space? That's the right. don't make a lot of sense after that. A whole bunch it's of like mumbo the jumbo mind was chat. Apart. I don't see anything about how they got back into human territory. The Geth turned them into husks and left the ship where someone would find them, trying to show us what happens to anyone who goes into it. Oh, smart. Goddamn number. Uh, so with that, Derelict Freighter. Yeah, it says you can just find that there. There are some missions you, you just randomly find and you don't get like a little quest prompt from. It was one of the rack now I gotta do. I wanna do that before I go to Vermeer. I'll have to look that up. If I even get to Vermeer time, which I might not. I realize now. Vermeer and stuff might be saved for tomorrow. Vermeer in the end game. So probably do Vermeer and then we'll do the Citadel part right there, and then we'll go Ilos and then maybe that would happen. It was all the bad. Thank you, give it so good. Thank you, we give it so no. I appreciate the very kind words. Have a great evening. Sleep well. Sleep well, my friend. It's been a real, it's been an amazing stream tonight, Chad. It's been absolutely incredible with all the biddies, all the donations, all the subscriptions. We're, I think we're nearly at 50 subs. Nearly at 50 subs. She had 49 subs. Woo! That's a lot. A lot of support. A lot of support. But you ass, a little sass, Chad. I love it. Uh, so we gotta get, yeah, we'll do get to Kazuka. Let me go over here. Uh, beautiful Joe. No, I've never played Beautiful Joe. I've never played it. Have I been to Vostok? I might have been to Vostok since then already. I don't remember. I don't recall. 
Mama Bow. Oh yeah, no, like oh no, this is part of the other. Uh, oh yeah, here Commander. it is. Commander. Yeah. No message, just a location. This, this is the quest. Never mind. This is it. Nordicrux. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, so a lot of a lot of missions in this uh uh system here. There's three. Nice. New it, chat scan. That asteroid, how big is this baby? Metal Rich Asteroid, 139 kilometers. Fuck yeah, give it to me. Love that. There's any more here, we're good. Let's get the rest of these worlds. We'll go to Nordicrux in just a second, chat. I wonder what mission this is. Is this the one of the, the monkeys? Might be. Take that. I think this might be the monkey mission, I don't remember. It's a whole bunch of monkey chat to try to kill me. <laughs> like literal space monkeys chat. I'm like, oh no, not the space. My most like, I'm, I'm, monkeys literally trying to kill us. It's pretty humorous. <laughs> you just come like fresh lay hard points. I love beat them up games that tell you uh, how tough a boss is by just giving them a different colored health bar. Oh Jesus. You gotta get them, you gotta get rid of all those bars, right? Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Yeah, it's kind of like Planet of the Apes. I think this planet has, um, I think it has, like, a cool secret here. I'm trying to remember. Anomaly. Uh, there's something really close by. Is that where the science facility is? Hold on. Actually, I don't know what the hell this is over here. A lot of enemies over here for some reason. I have no idea why. Maybe this isn't the space monkey planet. I forget what that planet then is. You actually get one of those little space monkeys in, like, as a pet in Mass Effect 3. Or, could have been 2 or 3, I forget. You give him as a pet. Oh, are these the Thorian? Yeah, Thorian creepers. Yeah, that's where they did their experiments with the Thorian over here. Look at all that poop. They're pooping. Oh, is that one of them alive? Oh, shit. They keep pooping, chat. So you'll, you'll find uh, random clusters of, of the... Um, of the little Thorian guys here. You could have equipped the Thorian gas grenades in a bit if I'm in a small structure. Uh, we gotta go get that material over there too. Let's go. Oh yeah, so this is not, I think it's another Cerberus mission. We we're like, yeah, you know, whatever. Yeah, we're experimenting on Thorian creepers. Yeah. It's fine. I got, so, I got so many items now. It's ridiculous. <laughs> uh, have you ever recruited? Mm -hmm. Interesting. Oh. Sarah, thank you so much for the bitty. Welcome to stream. It, looks, it does. It's a very pretty game. I've been I've been loving it. I've been very impressed with the remaster. There's some issues I have with it, but overall it's pretty good. Definitely a you know, I mean, most of the characters look great in it. Most of the characters look great in it. The environments are a lot better, the gameplay's a lot better. Few issues, but overall, really good experience. Really enjoying myself. And absolutely, absolutely happy to have you here, Sarah. How are you doing? Ooh, crossfire. Crossfire. Uh, get rid of some of these other things. Colossus. God damn, I gotta get the Drex. Uh, let's see how this ar armor looks on Shepard. I hate it. <laughs> I hate it already. <laughs> Assassin armor. Nope, don't like that. Nope. Let's get back. To, let's get my. Uh, oh, I, I didn't know I had this. I can put Shepard in light Colossus armor, which is better than even my heavy armor. But I don't like wearing light armor. I want to wear heavy uh, Colossus armor. So I'll just go back into my um, Onyx. And again, I gotta get—I gotta get rid of some of this crap. I got too much stuff. Volkov, Volkov, Volkov. It's vil it's very good. It's very good pistol. It's Volkov. Pistol. Everyone loves Volkov pistol. It is the uh, best pistol in game. Get rid of the edge. Don't do that one. Don't do the edge. Striker. Oh, storm. I have storm still? Jesus. I have a lot of Omni Gel now. Graham is happy about the low. Oh, me too. Oh, low times are great. Yeah, no, the technical aspects like that. Low times, thank God. 
He's stuck out back. I sure, Mr. Evan. Nice. Thank you. Welcome back. I have to get minerals. I must get minerals. It's up here, though. Ah, uh, that's the thing. I regard losing camera skin the enemies and the boss had health parts just like the beat em up games. Game was pretty much a hyper clef from a beat em up RPG. I, I, yeah, I guess never really. I didn't really know Kingdom Hearts was a platformer. I've only played a little bit of Kingdom Hearts 3, so I can't, I can't really say too much about it. Ah. Uh, oh, almost there. Almost there. No! Fuck. Alright, hold on. <laughs> we'll get. I've got it. I got it. I got it. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh boy. Yay! There's the poop! I found it, chat. There's the turret. Let's get it. Let's mine it. Whip. Beep, bop, beep, boop, beep. Cool. Nice. Oh, God. $34,500. Oh, that's not bad. Credits. Percent. Uh, and let's go ahead and get... Nope, not squad. We're gonna go to the map. We gotta go to... That location. That's where we gotta, go. Okay. gotta go explore that anomaly chat. How the fuck am I gonna get out of here? <laughs> How am I gonna get out of here? I don't remember. Oh, everything's so steep. Ah, shit. I have to go around, don't I? Oh, man. Shit. I don't know. Ah! You gotta fly. I wish I could. Oh no! Oh no! Come on! Oh my god, how the fuck am I gonna. Ow, 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 shit. I believe I can fly. I believe I can touch the sky. How the fuck do I get out of here? I'm lost and I'm scared. I go up here. Ah, damn it! I hate this part. <laughs> oh lord! I don't know which way to go. <laughs> I'm stuck inside this fucking awful place. <laughs> yeah, that's one of the this one of the struggles of Mass Effect One, Chad. These, these little vehicle sections here, where you get like, how do I get over this mountain? Okay, I gotta go toward the red the red screen of death chat, so I could die here. How the fuck am I gonna die? You need to turn back, Commander. You're going beyond the range of the operational area. Joker, I don't know what the else fuck to do! I think something could kill me here. I don't know if there's like missiles that come down or something, but I think something bad will happen. How the fuck do I escape this place? I'm dead. Alright, you know what? We're gonna go back to Normandy, we're gonna reset the mission. <laughs> I, I'm just gonna do it this way. We're gonna land back on the planet. <laughs> uh, I, I'm gonna have to play this collection in the future, putting some money back for Ratchet. No, I understand it. Seven, yeah, yeah. A little $70 games. I can't believe I don't want to explode. That's a trap right there. Be very careful. Well, you can just you can just reset. So there we go, Chad. Woof! You have the sounds. I want to explode. This conversation Shepard has with the Normandy crew. Well, Bane, okay. It's mostly like we'll have sex with each other. You need to turn back, Commander. Joker, don't fucking range. tell me what to do. Seth Green, I want to hear none of your sass. I'm in the operational area. Jesus. Got some Scar Mountain horse galloping. I tried. I, I couldn't get up there. I couldn't cheese. I was like, well, I'm fucking stuck here. So do that little mineral thingy last, chap. Bane, okay. It's pretty much what it is. McSass for ass is right. This plan is a fucking nightmare. Oh, God! Shit. Is this the planet where it has that little secret thingy? That might be over here, I don't remember. No, it's a science facility. I have no idea where that little secret thingy is. I gotta go up this fucking mountain again, Jesus! 
This planet is the worst. Everything's a goddamn mountain here. In those Dilthian crystals, Chris. The Dil yes! Indeed. It is green. It's not a it's not a brown, reddish shit color. I agree. But my god, everything's a mountain here. Makes me want to drink. I'm gonna get another drink after this mission, chat. Lord. Thank you! By the way, to call Wrath. I like your name. Sounds very powerful. Call Wrath, thank you so much for the follow and welcome to stream. I hope you're doing very well tonight. Hey, I got it. I'm here. I survived. Ooh, McSassfrass. McSassfrass, thank you for the follow. It's very kind of you. I really like your name. Sass Frass. Streams are all about the sass. The only thing to me is I want some juice. I need some juice. I need some juice myself. I didn't get hydrated. I need to stay hydrated. Yep, indeed. Turn sick again. Making that money. Making that XP. Fast Furious 10 Shepherd's Mountain. <laughs> Might as well be. Now we gotta go to this debris. I bet that's on a fucking mountaintop. Because of course it will be. Everything's on a mountaintop in this game. Or on this planet, at the very least. He was to see a garden stalker strolling across the mountain pass, followed by a scary piano music. No, I'm gonna like die after he gets hit by this. Oh god, it's the last thing I need to deal with right now. Every time those fucking things hit you, I was so frustrated. It's with Breath of Wild. No nope, shit, 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 shit. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, a little oomph. Got a little bit of oomph, chat. Need a little booty butt push. We got up there. We got up there, chat. Aha. Let's go over to these ancient. Oh fuck! I got scared. I was gonna get stuck. There's a nice little clear path over here. A little of the clear path, chat. I didn't know they were called the Garden Sucker. I always called them the Laser Guys. <laughs> that was my name for them. Oh, it's the Laser Guys. I hate them. Oh yeah, this planet has like animals. Look at these fucking deer. They got like the little, they got little hands. I think if I kill them, I get renegade points. I'm not gonna avoid it. I'm gonna avoid killing them, chef. Like they're deer with hands, which is the most horrifying fucking. Oh, oh. I think I ran it over. Which is like the most horrifying thing imaginable. Last thing we need in the, on this planet yet is deer with hands. No fucking thank you. It's a bulb. <laughs> I can see. I can see it. The, yeah, I can see the, the, the bulb comparison. I think this is the planet where the. I don't know. No, I think it is the monkey planet. I don't remember. Science facility. We'll go over here. God damn it. You're going back to deer. Like a deer, kangaroo, human. If like a deer and a kangaroo and a human were combined into like one animal, that's what they would fucking look like. And it's a nightmare. I'm like, yep, don't like that. Don't like any of that. Oh, shit. I gotta climb up another fucking mountain. You look at your left, you can see all the fields. Oh, fuck! <laughs> Pretty accurate. <laughs> oh, my lord. <laughs> Climbing up this fucking thing. This techniques back. And we didn't have the jet booster, too, either, Jet. The jet booster was not in the first game. They added this. This is a lot of hell. This took a lot longer to do back in the day. Oh. God, what a nightmare. I don't think I can get up here. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Fuck. <laughs> I hate this. <laughs> this is the fucking worst. <laughs> Jesus. Come on. Son of a bitch! <laughs> oh no. Narsho, you are the 50th sub today! Oh, I did it! I did it! We did it! Narjo, thank you so much for subscribing. That brings us to the total amount of subs they chat. 50. Wow, we wee -wa. Thank you, Narjo. Hey, Chris, you become one of my favorite streamers, and I always look forward to your content. Narjo, it's an absolute pleasure to have you here. Hope you're doing very well today, Narjo. Woo! Cheers and salute. 
Thank you for those kind words. That means no, seeing, seeing, reading stuff like that makes my day. This is fast for this is slow annoying. It is. This plant's a goddamn nightmare. Brownie, wowie. And now he's just twerking the chaos as I just struggled to get up there. <laughs> All right, let's go. Oh yeah, this base. Jesus Christ. I'm pain in the ass. I'm gonna blow this guy away. Boom. Hello. Got him. I hope they just pop. There's another one over here. Oh, there he is. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Got him. Got him. Whee. Ooh wee. Beep. I can do those Geth missions too in a bit, chat. You just making this where I am, exploding them. Keep exploding them, chat. It's good. It's good work. Make sure I don't miss anything over here. We good. Mass Effect came out in 2006, 2007. Time was age 47 dropping a mine for a guard to see, then exploiting the mines. The guard carries it through a crowd of lobby. Oh, yeah. Oh, uh, uh, Blood Money? You talking about Blood Money? Great game. Great Hitman game. But yeah, this came out in 2007. The same year as Bioshock. Oh, yep. Yeah, the, they got the wall sacks, chat. The giant testicles. I guess the Thorian's influence reaches that far. That's interesting. KC, welcome to you. What up, Chris? I love your streams. I kind of always make it my day to watch your stuff in the Thank you, KC. No, absolute pleasure to have you here. Yeah, I did my review for Shrek, Racked to the Eternals trailer, playing some Mass Effect. It's been good! Fight Doyen Creepus. Oh, they are just the Thorians dead. Well, I guess they're just mindless monsters. Garrus, what kind of gun do you have? Why does Garrus... Garrus, why do you have that gun? Hold on. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Garrus, what are you, what are you rocking? Raptor? Why the fuck do you have a raptor, Garrus? That's not what I gave you. Garrus, you silly billy! Uh, no, you need a crossfire, Garrus. That's what you need. I don't know why he had that. Why is that fucking weak weapon? That's odd. Garrus. Buddy. Boobala. Come on. I don't know how he got that weapon. I'm one of his other weapons. I accidentally sold it. Interesting. Yeah, Mass Effect and Dead Space came out the same year. I think Dead Space came out a year later. I think, I think Dead Space came out in 2008. They'll make Borg zombies. The Thorian, well, the Thorian vores you. And uh, he makes copies of you, I guess. Which is pretty gross. And he also sends out spores that controls the original hosts. Kind of very, very Invasion of the Body Snatchers vibe. I remember Dead Space came out in 2008 because that was also the same year that Fallout 3 came out, and I was obsessed with those two games. Those are like my two games of the year that year. I played them all the time. Mutiny! Mm -hmm. 2008 was an excellent year for video games. Little sci-fi body horror in the space. Yep, yeah, yep, yep. In space. Oh yeah, in this one, yeah, definitely. There's some body horror in Mass Effect, which is pretty cool. There's some, there's some more in Mass Effect too, and, and definitely in three. Reapers do a lot of horrific experiments on people. Yeah, they do a lot of body transformation type stuff. Cerberus does it too. Shepard's kind of an abomination in two and three. This is your uh, your favorite story? Love this uh, call, Yeah, it's great. No, th this one's great. No, Mass Effect One is a really good story. Saren's an excellent villain. Mm. Boom, chat. Oh, 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 mystery armor for Rex. Oh man, I might. Huh. That's a good get. I do have that medium armor though for him. Hmm. Colossus armor. Oh shit. Rescuers. Oh, oh yeah, God. I think these uh, people are all fucking See? uh terrorists. I told or you somebody would come to investigate They're all pieces of shit. My name is Dr. Ross, Chief Exo you were, Oh, it's Exo Jenny. That's facility. right, that's right. We've They're doing experiments. That's days. what it was. We're almost out of food and water. You got here just oh, you're in okay time. now. By the way, you're all under arrest. You're all under arrest. How do you know about the Thorian? Uh, I've seen it. I also killed it. <laughs> I know what Exogeny was up. Yep, you're all a bunch I of fucking liars and jabronis. So I destroyed it. 
That by stopped playing uh, no games late in the PSD generation. The Last of Us was you the last experience I had until I got my Switch. I just the stopped. Creepers here uh, were created using not yet, you. Samples from the Gaming, I mean, yeah, yeah. I can all understand the mindset like you don't want to fall behind. Docile, obedient servants. Mm -hmm. Everything was going fine until a few days ago. So I think these people all the creepers suddenly went berserk. Kill me or so they tried to attack me. I'm like, all right, I guess I'll slaughter all you. Why didn't you send a clear message? Yeah, well, Exo Jenny's like wailing you, Tony. Yeah, signal they're kind of the that company in Mass Effect. Effect. This is a closed communications base. Exo Jenny was worried about someone on the project selling secrets to a rival firm or reporting our work to the authorities. We have no direct communication with the As outside. As an apt Only comparison, the emergency beacon. It sends a general distress signal to the Exo Jenny. I saw that one, Fox. Yeah, I guess they're reshooting. They're supposed to send a team to respond inside <laughs> of 24 hours. probably shouldn't even do it to begin with. <laughs> it sounds like they had problems of their own. <laughs> Any chance some of the other people at the base might still be alive? Oh, they're fucking dead. Oh, yeah, I gotta go to their mm, base I now. That's it. right. Too many creepers out there. Yeah. They never stood a chance. We're the only ones left. Mm. Any idea why they turned on you? Maybe there was still some well, kind I, I of went to the link base. between I was, the creepers I was and the, the Thorian back on Pharos. Yeah. The Thorian was unlike... Any so it still had control of those stayed. thralls, even I can't explain how, a whole other systems light years away. Interesting. When it died, it it somehow set off the creepers here. Huh. That's interesting. All right, I well, you're all under arrest. Look, can't I know what we did here chances, was wrong. I'll admit that. I have my sympathies. But it's over now. I admire its purity. There's no sense reporting this uh, to yeah, the people lost their lives. Right? You're all going to jail. Shut up, you're going to jail. You were in charge of this My favorite project. Batman line, any Batman movie chat. Was your Memory turns a lot of issues, they but when he fucking you. punches Christopher you Walken in the face, trust. shut up, you're going to jail. Be Excellent line. I didn't mean Love for that. this to happen. Besides, how does it help anyone if I end up in jail? <laughs> Normally, Exo Jenny would have yeah, my back, nervous. but it sounds like they're going to have their hands full cleaning up the mess on Pharos. But... I've got Look, he's money. trying to fucking bribe a me, nice chat. Uh -uh. Fund I set up? Uh uh. It's yours if you let us go. Can't do that. The victims here deserve justice. I have to take you in. Uh, that's not going to happen. Alright, let's kill her. Open fire. Open All fire. Right. Sorry, girl. That's it for you. Got her. <laughs> she got blasted. Oh, Lord, chat. Jesus. Was that last guy? Guys, like, I'm sorry. Boom. Jay's second rate mercs proved no match for a train alliance marine. Goddamn right. With the last of the science crew dead, there's no reason to linger here. Took care of him, chap. Boom. She's a yeah, she's like Burke. Just like Burke. She's like, oh, who gives a fuck? Uh oh yeah, I got, 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 got I have too much shit. Is that pretty much it? Did I, oh no, the eight station. We'll open you up. There you go. A uh, wetware kit. God, see, I got I gotta sell a bunch of this crap. I'm just not using it. Sell some of this armor, or at least uh, get rid. I don't. I don't like any of the. I gotta get rid of all this phoenix. I don't know why I keep all this phoenix armor here. There's no point. Uh, we'll get rid of you. I might equip it for Ashley though. Hold on. Predator five phoenix. No. No, no for gears. I don't like that. Warlord Titan Scorpion Predator. Oh, Phoenix area, but oh, good. Okay, what what kind of armor type is that? Is that a? Uh, that's heavy armor. All right. Cool. Got it. Give me. And let me make sure that. Uh, let's see if I have any better stuff for Tali. Hold on. How about you, Garrus? You got any? You, you like any of these? No, tech cool. Oh, tech cool now is not might not be bad. Yeah, I might give him a chameleon tool, honestly, just for the hell of it. And Tali, no, I like what Tali has. All right, let's go. Let's get out of here, Chip. I ain't taking no bribe. Mm -mm, I'm honest. I actually like Batman Returns. Well, I, I like Batman Returns too. This is one of my favorite Batman. Selena Kyle's freakout scene used to get me because I had the summer freakouts, and so now I understand it. Losing her mind, man. Put upon by society. He was fatigued. He ran five feet, chap. You know, what happens when he gets fatigued? You know, what happens when he, he runs five feet? He wants to take a nap. He becomes a very sleepy boy. Weep. Get back to Normandy. Print these quests, and I got to do that super long Geth side mission. A little texture pop in there. And I think that's it for the science facility. Yeah, because I went to engineering debris, terrain wreckage. Uh, yeah, I guess that was it.
All right, let's go. Let's get going. Boom. All right. And now I think we got to do that Geth mission, which is very, very, very long. Geth activities, best get the Geth. Armstrong Nebula Cluster. There's some other missions I've met. There's a Rachni mission uh, out here. I'll have to look that up. But we'll do the we'll do the get. I gotta sell some of this stuff. I gotta make that money. Also, I gotta equip some new armor on some of my squad mates. Mixass uh, Frostblade, I meet you right now. It's my favorite in the in the franchise. Love Mass Effect. It's my favorite game. Now he's my favorite in the franchise. My favorite game of all time. He wants to hear a joke? Come here, Hazel. Tell tell us a joke. Do it now. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Uh, let's go. Yeah, go to Rex's locker. Uh, let's see if I can put some armor in. Ooh, Woo weed. You look good, Rex. You look good, baby. Um, God, class armor is so fucking good. I mean, he looks great in the thick armor there, but I might just keep him in the class armor because it's such great armor to have. Keep him in that one. Yeah. And we'll give you a better rifle, Rex. We'll give you a what's it? A crossfire. I'll give you a crossfire, Rex. Armageddon shotgun. I'm gonna give him a salt cut, actually. It's a lot better. Robber pistol. Equalizer. What's a harpoon look like? I hate it. I hate it. Oh, give him Polaris amp. Ooh, Savant. Fuck, that's really good. That's really good. All right. Oh, yeah. Give him some upgrades here. Uh, let's see here. Let's give him prototype armor upgrade combines mechanized armor to wear brute strength, resistance to weapon force, resistance to bottom tech. Interesting. Hmm. What does a deaf gyne uh, gynecologist do? What does a deaf uh, gynecologist do, Carmi Hazel? What do they do? <laughs> what What do they do? Tell me. Oh God! <laughs> I am uh, I am very curious. <laughs> he reads lips. Oh, that's good. That's a good one. I I gotta admit, you that, that that's not bad. <laughs> Studio audience applause. Brilliant. Nia likes it. Nia likes the joke. <laughs> Gloss. Oh, I didn't know she had fucking. Oh, wow. Well. Oh, that's right. I guess I can give it to Liara. Interesting. You're going to give it to Liara because uh, Kate's not going to need it, probably. <laughs> we'll give this to Liara. Mm hmm. Boom. There you go, Liara. I'm going to give you a better pistol, too. Raikou. That's a bit better. We'll give you some, um... It's kind of all around, so you have the R. Anywhere right now. God, I got so much. I gotta get rid of all these chrome repair. Combat optics, scram rail, kinetic stabilizer. Cool. Oh, shit. I'm gonna move this one in. Nice. Ashley, where's Ashley's locker? Here it is. Uh, you already have. Actually, let me go ahead and see what you have, Ash. Smash him. Um, this is better. Sure. Oh yeah, I gotta sell some stuff. I definitely have to sell a lot of stuff. I have to uh, fight since turns can't. Uh, we definitely have to have uh, Cranton. Yeah, yep, 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 yep. Looking for supplies? Yes. Let's see what you, you bet. Show me what you got, sir. Uh, a lot of mercenary armor, huh? All of this is useless to me. Jesus Christ, got a lot of useless shit. All right, let's see. Let's go ahead and sell here. So I'm gonna mark all this shit. God 
damn, I have so much crap. Uh, I'm gonna mark all this and sell all junk. We have chat. We'll sell you. We'll sell you. 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 Lancer, get out of here. Predator, get out of here. Razor Nets for some reason. Uh, get out of here. Um, Kessler, we'll get rid of the Kessler pistols. Chat, don't need that. Buy out of camp. Um, cryo, I get rid of all the cryo ammo. I hate all the goddamn cryo ammo. Um, Blade of coating, keep some of those for now. Uh, maybe the girl can get good for her, right? What did the toaster say to the slice of bread? What did the toaster say to the slice of bread, Naya? I am curious. There's all these tuck and stiff rounds. I gotta get rid of these. Alright, let me know all of them. I want you inside me. <laughs> I said nah, I didn't I? God damn it! <laughs> I did it again. I'm sorry. <laughs> I did it. Call me Hazel, Naya. <laughs> I apologize. <laughs> I don't know. I say that. Oh no. <laughs> oh shit. I don't mean to. <laughs> it just happens. It just happens. <laughs> I'll sing a match. Uh, <laughs> I think I'll have to by the end of the night. Make the attempt to, chat. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I delete data like you on the way to real eras. Ah, the Shepherd VI. So funny. Love that VI, chat. Seem like Wonder Woman. <laughs> I'll have to. I need to have a thick Israeli accent. Oh, Lord. Very nice, Chef. Very nice. Let me go ahead into my journal. There's another. I got to do some other missions. Geth is people with big name. Head to Armstrong Nebula Cluster to investigate what the Geth are up to. Armstrong Nebula, chat. Let's go. Armstrong Nebula. Don't no, converge. Six theta. Hockey data. I think it might be in sticks. I think it might be in the six theta cluster. That's where the Rakdown mission is. Message coming oh, in. Oh, here we go. Arcturus. Boom. Catching it Shepard. Normandy. Hey, Admiral Hackett. Admiral Hackett here. We're getting reports of a marked increase in Geth activity in the Skillian Verge. Surveillance drones have identified Geth outposts on four different planets in the Armstrong four cluster. Four different planets, chat. We have any idea what they're after? That's a lot. That's a, this is, this, I think it's the longest side mission in the game, technically. Intel on us. Or maybe they're setting you gotta up go to four different worlds to do it. Or worse. It could be the first wave of an invasion. Yep. Very true, Shepard. Let's hope not. We need someone to investigate this, Shepard. I'll do it. Finding Saren is still your I'll top find priority. It. But you've got experience fighting the Geth. The I, 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 I've, I've shot, I've killed a lot of fucking Geth. No question about that. We're transmitting all the locations Let's of the Geth outposts in the Armstrong cluster to the Normandy now. Neat. Admiral Hackett out. Okay. Oh, yeah, like all these places. So, like, all these systems have Geth bases on them. We all got to take them out. Boom, let's go. Let's go to Bamshi first. How do you make a pool table laugh? Color me Hazel. We say no bishop, right? Oh, Maji. Go to Maji in just a bit. Colonel Useless, welcome to the stream. How you doing, Colonel Useless? Hope you're doing very well. Tickle its balls. Ah, ha, ha. Come Hazel with the jokes. <laughs> yeah, I was just with the ME380. Which one did you choose? What, what color? It better have been red. That's the only choice. That is the logical choice, my friend. Let's make sure to hope you get a good prize at the end and not just a bag of rupees or a bomb. Uh, I get Tali's never ending respect, which I appreciate. And it locks Tali's um, side mission, which is pretty goddamn cool. I like that one a lot. Helps her on her pilgrimage. 
I also get you get a lot of equipment in these missions. Some rare loot. Ooh, oh wow, they added grass this plan. I don't think it's had grass last time. Neat. Alright, well we gotta we gotta do a oh, lot so many so many things to do on this planet. Anomaly, debris. Well, they won't be as mountainous as last time. What do you call it? Cheap circumcision. Oh, God. <laughs> what do you call it? Cheap, cheap circumcision. Call me Hazel. You know, the one where my character just gave up and said no free will and shit. Oh, damn. Well, that's a dark, that's a dark ending. Yeah. A ripoff. Oh, Lord. Ah. I feel that joke. I feel that joke, and I don't like it. I don't like the way, the way it makes me feel. Cutting cores, I can see that. Just the tip. <laughs> options. Oh, the, hold on, chat. I, 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 I drove right by it. Whee! Got it. A shortcut? Ah, that would be good. This is funny too, chat. Got it. Making my money. Let's go over here. This planet looks miserable. It's like Mars. Is the red ending destroying the... Yep, that's the right... That is the only choice, to me at least, that makes sense. Always gotta go with that ending. Oh, look at that blue moon. Look at that. Ow, it's so bright. Ow, my eyes. Nah, it's the red ending. What was Shepard's mission through all the games? Destroy the Reapers. Boom. At least that's the one I've always picked. I'm the one that I always did. I never picked the other uh, endings. I was like, ah, that's the one I'm going for. Ooh, ancient debris. But did I just go? I'm gonna pass it. Uh, this is like sticking out of the. Okay. Let's get it, chat. Let's get that artifact now. Alternate player. No! I do not want that. That's a dark alternate ending. Don't don't force that upon me, stranger shoe. <laughs> That's scary. That's a scary ending. Oh, this question. Oh, is that this one show up my map? It does not. Interesting. Huh. Don't you like the Super Soldier Stream? They bring out what we already are. Ha ha ha. Whee! Oh, it's a skull. Oh, is this the skull? Oh yeah, the body. Oh yeah, the fucking ancient uh discovery. This mask is uh, scored by deflected mask accelerator shots. Gene biology uh, files your heart to computer can identify species. Must have been brought here from an unknown world. Ooh. Oh yeah. So don't I? I think there's parts of the body. There's the Geth outpost. I forget. I think I see find parts of it on this planet. I don't remember. Well, I had the assumption that my character would control the Reapers because I was going Renegade. Then I realized it's not like uh, it's not like Kotor where you can choose a dark side. Actually, I mean you, you you can do that. So the end. I mean, you know, I don't know if I want to do spoilers. People might not be familiar with Mass Effect, but basically the three endings to me represent what uh, like certain characters want, and it's like the destroy ending to me is what Shepard always wanted. At least what I view as what anyone Shepard would want. The blue ending, the control ending is what the elusive man wants, and the green ending, synthesis ending, is what Saren wants. So control is where you control the Reapers, synthesis is where it's amalgamation of flesh and steel, the strengths of both weakness of neither, which Saren says, which is a combination of uh, organic and inorganic matter. <laughs> not not, right, not smiles. Okay. <laughs> it's true. You ready for get base in there? Oh my god, this is a long, this is a very long side mission. I'll do as mo most of the, uh, much of this. I gotta get another drink. I forgot. I gotta get another drink. Totally forgot about that, chat. After I do this little uh, mini game here, give me the stuff. All right, cool. What am I upgrading? Uh, by the way, must be close. Very close. Very very close. Nice. Good. All right, chat. I'm gonna go get myself another beverage. You know, buy one take the. Oh yeah, no doubt, definitely. Uh, I, I it, it seems to be like. Because, you, know, well, you know, they're working on a Mass Effect sequel. It seems to be take place immediately after the events of Mass Effect 3. Um, or sometime after. Uh, with the galaxy's in a state of chaos because of the end of the Reaper War. 
and it looks like they are taking the destroy ending, which I am all about. So they're gonna pick a cannon ending. I think it's cool. I mean, you know, it sucks. That it's like cause everyone's shepherd journey is is their own, and some people think controls the most natural option. People think synthesis was the option. Hey, more power to you. I get it. That's why I'm always like, hey, your shepherd is your shepherd. But it looks like they're going with destroy ending the red ending. We'll see though. We'll find out. I don't know. Could not be it. Could be something completely different. I'm hoping it's that though. Oh. Uh, but yeah, I'll be right back. Please entertain yourselves amongst yourselves. Gonna get myself another alcoholic beverage. Cheers. Soon to be cheers. Ha. Back. Cheers and salute. Happy to have you here, guys. Thank you for making this an amazing stream tonight. Thank you. Mm. Nice. Or if I were to do a Kojima, uh, whether Meryl lives or dies, they're both can. What? <laughs> I'm just going to gap over the quarians. The decision took me a while to make. I get the armors of both sides, though. Oh, you didn't have enough, uh, uh, um, I don't know, we either either skill checks to uh, save them both. I saved them both. I'm going to try to do that in this playthrough. But I get you. You and Josh will get along very well. Oh, no. Oh, you oh you killed the Geth of the Quarians. Oh, I'm sorry. I, mean, I misread that. I thought you said you killed the Quarians of the Geth. Yeah. Yeah, I just, I, I, I managed to say both. I've had to jump in Tali's my girl, and I'm like, ah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Let's go ahead, and uh, I think we got to go to this base over here. Whip. Get that post. It's kill it, Chef. Do it. Yeah, I smell this. What is happening? <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I don't understand anything you're saying. <laughs> He's like, what? Huh? <laughs> yes. Let's go. Oh, there's a uh, minerals. Mineral deposits chat. Oh, joy. Oh, yes. I uh, love me some minerals, Marie. Well, what was your dirty joke, buddy? I'm sorry I missed it. I'm sorry. I had to uh, get myself a drink and I gotta go. I have to go potty. Over here. Whoop! I'm gonna get up there. Hey, poop! Are there any uh, prairies uh, uh, in this universe? Like, yo, like, yeah, 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 yeah. There's like fields and shit. These plants are just rough. Because the Geth occupy them because nothing else can occupy them. Everything is mountain. Everything is mountains. <laughs> a lot of mountains in Mass Effect 1. Not a lot of flat terrain. We're, we're late game, and so these are like the hardest plants to go to. The hardest uncharted worlds. And boy, they're a pain in the ass. I got lost when I was driving into for Uber. I'm going uh, to the woman to ask for direct. She's eating watermelon with her dress up. I'm like, man, this your thing need air. She said, no, but it keeps the flies off. Jesus Christ. <laughs> yep. <laughs> God damn. Anyway. Oh, his minerals right here. Nice. Oh, and so is the Geth base right here, too. Fuck. Oh, Jesus. Uh, hopefully they won't kill me when I do this. I like them not to shoot me as I get these minerals. Beep bop beep boop. Nailed it. Tally's my girl, Mac Mac uh, 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 McSassafras. <laughs> That's all I have to say. Now you pretty much had my Oh shit the turret. I missed it. Nice. Uh, this will help with the with the upgrading. This is kind of a path up here. This is good. This is tolerable. Yeah, if you don't romance Holly, then she lusts after Garrus. Unless you're a femme chef, you, you're lusting after Garrus. That's true. That's true. Hey, I want them to be happy. You know. But it's funny. You won't, you won't see that romance in any of my playthroughs since... Uh, I'll be romancing Garrus with my fem ship. And I'll be romancing Tali with my male ship. Oh shit! 
Oh god! Ah, I'm falling over again! It's a nightmare! Hold on, I'm almost up. Got it. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Boom. Oh, you didn't just get destroyed. There we go. Got it, level up. Hell yeet. What's better, Paragon Renegade? I'm all about Paragon, but I like the Renegade actions you can do. Like those little pop-ups in Mass Effect 2 and 3. Those are fun. I will do I'll do pretty much all of them in Mass Effect 2 and 3. They're uh they're a good goddamn time. Oh yeah, I can upgrade Commando. Commando. Very nice. Uh I think I'll be able to upgrade all of these, maybe. Come closer, please. Yeah, it should be. So two more. I'm level 25 right now. Five more, two plus ten. I think it's ten, right? So ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'll have to miss one of these. I'll probably uh skip. I don't know. Think about it. Hmm. Anyway. Alright. Okay, so I probably should have upgraded you in sniper rifles, I realized, but I didn't do that. So we'll keep going. I guess I can get you damn your salt tree. Increase weapon damage. Dude, this one, who cares? The Talster. Give you first aid, Tali, obviously. Alright, cool. I am satisfied. For a backstory for the uh for a character? Oh wow. Oh, that's a great question. Like overall favorite backstory? Damn. That's a hard question. Morden's really interesting. Morden's really dark. I really like Morden Solus' backstory in Mass Effect 2. And just how he, I just love his character arc and what he does. Oh shit, I forgot to get through here. Yep. Remember that Geth base I'm supposed to attack? Oh yeah. Got I missed. I missed. Alright, buddy. Why? And they're like a tick. Oh! Colossus. Oh, man, these things take a lot of damage. Oh, shit. Woo! One down, three to go. Hell yeah. We gotta do this three more times. <laughs> nice. Get going. Yeah, I think, uh, yeah, don't, yeah, Morden City. I think if I had to pick a backstory, I think Morden Soul is a very interesting backstory. Yeah. Tali is awesome, unless she's on the kids. <laughs> well, she won't be, because, uh, I'll be lusting after her in Mass Effect 2 and 3. The Super Mario RPG is a great game. It was on the N64, right? I believe? Maybe? Alright, let's go to the next, uh, one. It's pretty good. Pretty good. Chat. Watch you. Keep watching. I will. Suppose you don't know. If those of you might be new, like uh, uh, McSassforas, I will be taking a break from. Uh, well, I'll be obviously completing Mass Effect One. Sure, probably tomorrow. Um, so this mission is fairly long. I'm gonna try to do bring down the sky tonight. If not, then I don't know. We'll see. But uh, I'll definitely complete this Geth mission. Um, but after I complete Mass Effect One, I'm gonna go back to Resident Evil Village, do my hardcore playthrough, then I'll play Mass Effect Two, then I'll go back to Eternal, and I'll do Mass Effect Three. That should be a fun time, chat. So many games I want to play. So many games. Super Nintendo, that's, that's what it was. I knew it was uh, an, an early Nintendo system. I forgot it was SNES or 64. Thank you for the correction. Wait. Oh, no, I don't want to land on Caspin quite yet. Not quite yet, chat. I want to scam. Check how those other missions are the those the collectible missions I'm, I'm I've been working on. See how far I am. I think I might have completed some of them. I feel like I have. Might not have. I'll I'll, I'll check in a bit. When I land the planet here. Uh, God, take my, my 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 favorite duo, chap. Yeah, the most popular squad mates according to Bioware, for Legendary Edition, uh, is Tali's number one and Garrus is number two. Those are the most uh, used squad mates across the entire series, at least for the Legendary Edition, in one, two, and three. Which makes sense because they're they're they are they are squad mates always, throughout the series, um, and I think people like the consistency. 
I think that's why they have him, because Tali and Garrus have been through it all of Shepard. And I think that's why he has a very, at least, you know, I, I'm in my own mind or whatever. But I like the th it's things that Shepard has a really, good, a really close connection with them, whether as friends or love interests. I think it's pretty cool. Uh, oh, yeah, I got you my journals. Let's see. Okay, how are these doing? Oh, I completed one of them. All right, so those, that's pretty close. Uh, so I need six more rare earths, three more light metals, and one more heavy metals. It's not bad. Uh, so I did the, looks like I, um, I did the, uh, matriarchs. Talked to Bullet, got that done. I need five more league medallions. Blood also counts if you take him. That's true, that's true. That's true. Even though she was involved in the collector stuff, but I agree, I agree. She has become a temporary squad mate in Mass Effect, um, two, uh, DLC, Lair of the Shepherd, which is an excellent DLC. It's my favorite of the DLCs in Mass Effect 2. Okay, uh, Geth Outpost, Anomaly, then we got three more Anomalies, okay. Anomaly's like, oh, that's the thing. Hmm. Shep has major plot, or, I mean, Shep, Shepard literally died in Mass Effect 2 and came back. It's pretty good. Super Mario was the last, uh, the game Square made for Nintendo before they became Sony exclusive for the rest of the 90s. So it was Phoenix. Square Enix. Back when they were Squaresoft. I love I love the days of Squaresoft. Yeah, a lot of great RPGs, JRPGs came from um, Squaresoft. Square back in the day. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I will I will definitely play some classic JRPGs on my channel one day. It will happen. Just so many games I need to play. I'll be playing Final Fantasy 4 and 6 VI and 9, since those are my favorites in the series. I will probably replay Final Fantasy VII Remake this year, because I know they have that big DLC coming out. So I will just replay for the hell of it. Maybe it'll be fun. It'll be a good time. Oh, Jesus. Oh, there it is. What is that where... God, it's fucking mountains, chat. Oh, Lord. Where the hell is this thing? Is it up... Oh, God damn it. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I hate this. Why is it like this? Why couldn't they fix this? <laughs> oh. Oh, the Y series? Not familiar with the Y series. Oh, Yakuza? Oh, you mean Yakuza? What the fuck is this thing? Is it up here? Is it literally up here? Oh, my lord. Oh, this fucking sucks. I don't know what the Y's is. I have no idea what that is. I've never heard of that. Fuck! Hold on. Hold on. Please. Please. There it is! Ha ha! Alright, fine. I'll just get out. I don't give a shit anymore. I'm just gonna get out. Oh, yeah, the upgrade also when the, um, when the release file they say. Oh, cool! Like, visual upgrade? Nice. I'll be playing on PS5. I, last time I played was on PS4. That streaming series is on my YouTube channel. Check. Class in the Glass. You want to check that out? Like a seven or eight part series I did. Pretty fun. I, I really did like the game a lot. It was in my top ten that year. Also, anyone new to the Juicy game that uh, wants more of that Chris Herman gameplay, you can find him more Tuesday, Monday. Oh, you can find him on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesdays on D for DD Glee. You got Double Toast and Swish It. Thank you. Double is free. That's very kind of you to say. Yes. I will be back tomorrow, chat, on Double Toast's channel, as uh, Dobby says, at 1 p.m. Central Standard Time. I'll be playing Alan Wake. I was supposed to play it today, but apparently the 11-year-old game needed an update, which I was like, wait, what? So, tune in for that. It'll be fun. Shit, I'm gonna get stuck in here. No, no, no. Got it, nailed it. Why is this place the way it is? Why is this all mountains? Jesus, God. I'm near here. Where do I go again? <laughs> nah, you're not new. Oh, my lord. This, this goddamn... Oh. There we go. There we go. We're gonna make this work, I swear to God. It's gonna happen. I'm gonna get over here. There we are. Ha-ha! There's my YouTube channel right there. You guys want to check it out? I bought his post, but thank you, Dobby. It's very kind of you to say. Yeah, 
I was, uh, I did an impromptu stream of Resident Evil 7 Biohazard Madhouse difficulty in Jesus Christ. That was hard. <laughs> I don't think I'll ever, I don't think I'm ever gonna play that game on Madhouse difficulty. And I was like, ah, hmm, yes. That was quite difficult. See, race. Woo, nice. Happy to hear that one. Fuck. No, I'll I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna replay the game. I'm looking forward to it. I liked it a lot. I had a, I had a few issues. I didn't like the side missions in that game, but overall, it was, it was a good experience. I just remember all those, all those women just thirsting after Cloud, and how he's so disinterested in all of them. <laughs> Everyone from Tifa to Aerith to uh, Jesse. Especially Je Jesse, my god. She was literally, Jesse was literally humping Cloud in cutscenes. And he's like, whatever. <laughs> he could give a shit less. It was so amusing to me. Job is free. They go to minis. Got to spread the word and get the motion. Oh, thank you. Now, no, this has been a. Me the party. This has been an excellent night, chat. We've done very, very well. Very, very well. Been a, mostly in the 70s, uh, if not over, for most of the night. Hearts pit a pattern, Dobby. Thank you. I know it's winding down. I know it's already at 1 a.m. So, but uh, oh shit. Oh god, this shoot at me already. Fuck. Oh, I got to shoot right. Did I grab another thing over there? What was this? I already collected that, right? Yes. What the hell is this? Make what? What? Not a signal. Oh, hello. Oh shit. Oh. What's this base doing? Oh shit! Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh Jesus. Is it? Oh my God! There's a lot of oh my God, there's a fucking nightmare over here. Especially does give you a lot of XP though. Seems right up on me, chap. Yeah, I got that. You got that Eastern Standard Time. You got that EST. Blackstone. Yeah. I used to live on the East Coast. Uh, we got to activate this. Let that just float in the air, but fair. Boop. Got it. It's a trap. Oh. oh. Well, let me go ahead. Let me go ahead. Did I? I got the engine debris, I think. Yeah, my mom's like, I got it. Let's go uh, get to that get that post. Let's go. Go oh, moth tomorrow, so probably uh, go down to Lurk. has a little coffee shop. Oh, that sounds lovely. That sounds like a lovely time. Wind Fox. It's, oh, it's a sturdy Mako sturdy vehicle. Almost flipped. Make use of flip over all the time in the original game. So I got some research. I got some more poop. Looks like a gold deposit. Go over here. Get that. Whee. Go up here and grab it. Look at all that pull. Do it. Very nice. Metal, is that what I needed? Good journal. Good. Oh, I think I completed the heavy metal. It's nice. All right, and now we're gonna go over to. Oh, did I? Uh, oh, did I destroy the Gethany? Am I good? Oh no! I, oh no! I gotta go over there. I gotta go to get Jesus Christ. Let's pay attention. That's how you know I'm getting tired. I've been there, right? And it's like, nope. No, you have not. Oh. Go over here. Mm -hmm. Just random meteors and asteroids falling in the goddamn planet. Look at all these comets, Jack, coming down. God. Oh, Jesus. Everything's jammed. Yep, Geth base is very nearby. I don't know where the hell I'm going. I imagine it's this way, maybe, possibly, I don't know. Uh, it's obviously up the mountain. No question about that, gotta make it difficult on me. Am I heading the right direction? Let me see. I am very close to it. I am very, very close to it. Here it is. Got the get face. Got 
Get out of here. I can't get out. Can I get back? Yeah, we're gonna turn the Normandy. <laughs> I suck myself. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Thank God that was the last thing I needed to do on that planet. It would have been a huge fucking pain in the ass. Oh my lord. <laughs> oh god. Oh, there's a photo mode. I just realized there's a photo mode in this game. That's cool. Neat. All right. I don't kill the ship, more XP from its troops. Yep. Yep. I forgot about that. You're right. You're absolutely right. Got a whole mess of XP right there, which I'm pretty jazzed about. Go to the dish cool. This is the dish cool. Right, let's go for the troop ship. I was wondering if I could was be able to do I think Anabar's the planet I gotta go to. Yep, yes it is. I'm gonna go there quite yet. Be a little patient, chat. Check this out. Oh, no. Carper Carcarasis Asteroid. Thank you. Thank you. That's nice. Alright, good. Um, go here. Survey Patamal Patamaloras. Very nice. Rich in the resources chat, which is what I like to see. Thank you. Give me that. Give me all that XP. Give me all that money, honey. Pretty. But useless. Uh, let's see this one. Oh, I love that they have, like, oh, like hey, learn about this plan. I don't even read it. I think I re read it back when I originally played the game, which is pretty cool. I want to spend all that time reading the planets <laughs> to you guys. I don't think you guys be like, Chris, please stop. Just please shoot things. I'm like, okay. <laughs> okay. Yes. Whip. Oh, yeah, you can kill the ship, though. Yeah, you can definitely kill the ship if you want to. It had, it had a health bar, health bar. But, um. I wanted to avoid uh, I was like, I forgot about it. Like, oh, yeah, you can just shoot the troops and yeah, you get more XP. That is an absolute fact. Chat. We. Oh, it's a snow planet. Oh, I love the skyline. It's very pretty. Oh, I love the pink and purple. Very nice. All right, where are we going? Uh, anomaly, debris. Definitely, okay, we're gonna go to the anomaly first. Go to the anomaly first, then we'll go to the debris, and then we'll get a guess. Well, I'll read the planet evils from the in, uh, from the interesting. Ah! That's a good point, Max Assassin for ass. The Q will please shoot things and have sex with things. I can definitely do all those. I've been doing it. No doubt. No doubt. Like Clendigon? I think, I'm not, what have I been to Clendigon? I think, oh, this is a fucking Thresher Maw. This is a Thresher Maw. I think this is the other Thresher Maw here. Maybe. I think there might be a Thresher Maw here. Let's look at the layout of the land. It looks like a Thresher Maw territory. 
Yup, knew it. Fucking knew it. Knew it, chap. Yep. Just assholes. Oh, I got you. The little hentai. Get. Oh, they all got bamboozled by the uh, Thresher Maw. Neat. The ilk of the human corpses show the telltale signs of Geth weapons fire. The Geth have been mangled by the Thresher Maw. At least the guy was coming to them. God damn right. That's neat. We'll go over here because there seems to be an uh, altar of some kind. Free loot! Look at this. The Graboids, the Xenomorphs, and the ID4 Island. Yeah, I can see that. Definitely. A very good comparison, Blackstone. Carthian Ruin. Oh. What is this? Cover artifact. Hell yeah. Bro, the dad is. Ah! It's wrapping one of the Thresher Maw's many victims. Oh, Neat. Cool. Gotcha. Very good. Back in the ship. Go to the debris, space debris. Very nice ship, very nice. You said you can't sex the Krogan. You can't, yeah, can't do it. I'm sure people have been asking about Romance and Rex or Grunt, but they're like, nope. I think, like, I feel like if male or femme chef had sex with Rex or Grunt, that they would literally explode. <laughs> The Krogans seem to have very forceful, they're very forceful lovers. And they have, you know, the male Krogans have, like, you know, four testicles. And I feel like it would just be an explosion of krogan -gism. <laughs> And I'd be very scared about that. <laughs> only an erotic, definitely only an erotic fanfics, no question. Oh, like, I can imagine Mass Effect. There's a lot of Mass Effect fanfiction out there. A heapin' helping on the chat. More space fanfic rubs, snips, Miss <laughs> I need it all. Give it to me. It'd be great. <laughs> Might get some space. Might get some Mass Effect fanfiction. We'll see. I'll look, I'll look into it. <laughs> I gotta get some Shrek ones. That, I, that's, that was a great idea. Two after Grunt's mission, Chef gets request to breed from a Krogan. Oh, that's right! Oh, so, but only if uh, if you're a Fem Shep, correct? Or was it male Shep? Or like a female Krogan wants to, like, yeah, let's do it. Try to remember. Die right, he's like, no! Either. Nice. <laughs> I feel like if, if Fem Shep was pregnant with, with Krogan, she would explode. <laughs> Ah! Oh, the Gath. What's the Gath? Where's the, where are they? Oh, I'm heading right. Am I in the right Yes. Very serious that it's races. I always go for the sexy reptilian race. That's why, as a fem chef, I go for uh, Garrus. He's my sexy uh, alien lizard bird boyfriend. He has reach and I have flexibility. Woo! Got him. Okay, all right, let's relax now, Gep Colossi. Okay, all right, baby. Got it. Shit. Shit, 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 shit. 
shit. Garrus, you're correct. You don't know about the fifth outpost. I didn't know about it. He's very rich. Lorenzo, have a fantastic evening. District 9 Space Cat. Yep, he is District 9 Space Cat. Also, uh, Lizard Bird Boyfriend. Great. Have a great night, Squeeze Beaver. Thank you, Lorenzo, for all the support. <laughs> the kitty cat. Does Garrus look that way? Does Garrus really look that way? Does he look like that? Oh, you haven't seen him. He's got the mask on. <laughs> Let me see. Can I talk with the helmet off? Nope. Won't even take the helmet off. Equipment. Ooh. Yes, 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 yes. I got all the stuff. All this stuff, chat's good. All right, we're gonna get off the planet. I have my codex, oh yeah. Uh, Marco Entries view, nice. Map, got all that done. All oh, that's done, chat. That boy in Breath of Wild, however, I'm hot for the sexy bird man. Yeah, man, he's a good looking guy. Bird people are good looking people, chat. Bird person. Uh, risk against time, oh yeah. I'll get it, I'll find it when I want. I don't wanna go to Vermeer quite yet. Ooh, gee, I still need to find six rare earths and three light metals. Got that. That is the... I need four league medallions. I don't know where the rest of those are. All right, we're going to go to the other cluster right here. Looks like Cobra Commander. <laughs> Cobra! I can see that. I can definitely see that Valkyra. Get them to just scan it. I, oh, shit, I don't want to go all the way up. Whoops, 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 whoops. Yeah, and I don't want I hate missing them. I might look at like a guide later on and see like, okay, where did I, where did I miss this? Uh Gargi. Go this job. Let's go. It's getting a lot of plans so far in this game. It's getting a lot. Survey. Survey says, oh. Yeah, a lot of extra that I've never completed the Matrix writings, but eh, it's cool that, you know, keep giving me more. Pressure. That's I don't think that was the one I landed on. Incorrect. That was not the one. This one is that has the um, giant terrestrial animal skull, like, possibly on it. Watch mm -hmm. Cobra Commander turn into uh, a snake, a G.I. Joe, who he used to mess with. Oh, I didn't know he did that. Holy shit. Ah. I was blown away that uh, Joseph Gordon Levitt was Cobra Commander. I was like, wait, what? <laughs> I had no idea. I was like, oh my god. <laughs> I didn't expect that. That one surprised me. Also, uh, I, I've only seen a little bit of the sequel. What was it called? G.I. Joe. Whatever, that was the sequel to the, the Rise of Cobra was. But there is a fucking line where I, most of the actors are replaced, or they just don't, they don't have them back. The characters, they don't have them back. I know, like, they killed Shane Tatum off, like, when the, the first five minutes or something. But there is a line where Cobra Commander, they, they free him from this weird prison facility where he's all, like, they're in these cryo tubes and they're underwater. I don't know, it's hot. And he, I guess, they're, like, one of the, the, the villains in the last movie is, is Deathstroke. I believe it's Deathstroke. And he's freed by, um... Uh, Storm Shadow and maybe some other ones. And I remember, like, Cobra Commander turns around and looks at uh, Deathstro and says, You're out of the band. <laughs> and I'm like, What? <laughs> Deathstro, that's it. <laughs> You're out of the band. <laughs> I'm like, Oh, okay. <laughs> that, that amused me greatly, is all I'll say. Oh, look at that. Go over here. Woo, this is like the Tatooine planet. It's like Tatooine at night. This is the moon of uh, Clendigan because of Mass Effect 2. Oh, see, I don't remember. I don't remember. Image I Jim Wee Cobra Command is punished for his failures by being turned into a snake and it's not a quick change. 
You watch him lose a man, he multiples him, where he goes full stack. Damn. Well, 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 uh, oh, uh, who punishes him? I thought he's the leader. Chris had to go by Benny's. Yeah, they killed off Christopher Eccleston's character because he didn't want to come back. Even though the last movie ends with him getting a mass permanently burnt in his fucking face. What did they kill? Did they kill him off in the movie? I just, he just kept him in the tube. That's right, that is Chris Eccleston. You're right. I reviewed that film chat, and it'll eventually be uploaded on my YouTube channel. Uh, I think I gave it like a rental or something. I believe. I didn't hate it, but I was like, yeah, it's goofy. I think I gave it a rental. Yeah. Okay, it was actually going to be in the sequel, so he requested to be killed off the first 15 fucking minutes. <laughs> oh, wow. Damn. Is he like the main character of the G.I. Joe movies? Oh shit. Oh shit. I oh there we go. I'm good. Serpent Nitter is the main villain of the animated movie. He punished Cobra Kim every center. I never watched G.I. Joe, so I'm very unfamiliar with the the lore in general. Some of them I'm sorry, I got stuck. That's what? Hey, ooh, what's this? What's this shit? Ooh. The commander of G.I. Joe's movie is the descendant of snake people. <laughs> wow. Literal snake people. Okay. Fair enough. I didn't mean to do that to the cargo. The cargo was just in my way. It was in my way and things happened. I'm sorry. Oh, God! Keep running over things. Funny. Skull animal skull. I mean, that was the animal skull. I remember. Uh, crash escape pod. R two D two C three P. Are you here? It's our lot in life. Hey, who's in my base? Uh, team's death is so fucking stupid. Him and the other Joes are getting shot. Truck blows up behind him, and then he just disappears. And when they find his body, the more they didn't even show his face. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah. Now they're rebooting the series, aren't they? With that. Um, uh. Was it the Snake Eyes movie? I want to, no, actually, I don't want to do the Geth. I want to go to the debris first. We'll go to the debris first, then we'll go to the Geth camp. Oh, was a Threshema on this planet? I thought it was the last one. Snake Eyes, yeah. Which isn't like fucking Snake Eyes' thing, though, is that he doesn't talk. Is that like a big part of his thing? And now, uh, and he doesn't show his face ever. And this movie, he's talking, he's showing his face all the time. <laughs> I'm like, that's kind of, that's kind of weird. I know, I, I know he's like the most popular character and everything. But they're like, they seem to be promptly ignoring everything about him. <laughs> they're like, yeah, whatever. Any flat terrain or special moss? Oh, shit. Sure. How, how has the reaction been? You know, I gotta be honest. I'm not a big G.I. Joe fan. I'm like, okay, whatever. That, I'm like, all right. The movie's happening. What has the reaction been from the G.I. Joe community to Snake Eyes? That's in the continuity. Fair enough. Well, Smart Weaving's playing Scallic. I like Smart Weaving. She's a good actress. She was great in Ready or Not. Thorium deposit. <gasps> Sounds like the Thorium. Somebody wants to. Beep. That's a call. Beep. Alright. Here. Oh, these goddamn mountains. Oh, I hate it. Why not? Oh, there they are. Because I didn't accurately pinpoint it. There's a G.I. Joe community. I mean, like, well, the, like, fans. The fan community. Don't know about someone who enjoys G.I. Joe. It's dumb moments plots. It looks promising. There we go. No, fair enough. Hey, no more proud of people that, that you know, that like G.I. Joe. G.I. Joe. 
ham sandwiches. Trying to get a read on things, you know? Beep, bop, beep. Let's go attack that goddamn Geth base, chat. This is the second, even though this is the last base. It's like, nah. There's a whole other one. There's a whole other base, chat, which I completely forgot about myself. It's the hardest one, I think. There are like three facilities on like a planet somewhere. It's like, ah. That does unlock the, the little data for Tali, which is a easable, uh, very easily missable side quest for her. It actually uh, helps you in Mass Effect 2 briefly. It's pretty cool. It does feel like Mars. Agreed. I got a feel I'm going, oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus, chat. Yeah. The guy's, uh, the director's the guy. Who's the director? Oh, yeah, the Warren Ellis miniseries I heard was really good, actually. I've heard that consistently. I said it was like, he's actually, wow. I actually did a really good job with that. I have heard that. I think I've seen, like, the animated fight between Storm Shadow and, um, Snake Eyes from that movie. I was like, this is cool. I remember liking that. I was like, oh, this is neat. Why did a couple movies be this way? I gotta go to the other side of this fucking thing. God damn it. God damn it. Remember Schwinnick? He did a flight plan. Never saw it. Time travel his wife. That sounds familiar. Red. Ooh. Eh, I didn't like red. RIPD. Ooh. Ooh. RIPD. That was a rough one. And the two Divergent movies. I never saw, but I heard were not great. Hurt, they were pretty not great. Did they, they even finish that series, right? That series just did, that series just stopped. They're like, all right, I guess we're just done making movies. Is that what happened with them? Oh, here's the oh, that could have went the easy way. I'm like, yeah, we're just not gonna make any more of these movies. Like, they, it just ends. It's gonna be like the anime series Renegades. It was GI Joe mixed in the eighties. Oh, that's fun. Yeah, they just stopped making Divergent movies, right? And yeah, they tried doing the splitting the book into th uh, uh, book three of the two movies thing, but part one uh, bombed so bad they never bought making part two. <laughs> That's kind of unique. They never even bothered finishing the franchise. In route. They're like, yep, okay, we're done. Did they ever do like a... I guess they didn't. I was going to say, hey, did they ever do a book to explain... <laughs> no, it's based on books. Chart, we're gonna fucking save in case I die horrifically here. Uh, flat plan, that was a diehard ripoff that tried to trick you into thinking he was a psycho. Oh. Movies were making less and less money, they were waiting long sleep. There's this fuck it, just like, why? What's the point? Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah, no one else cares, why should we? That's fair. Oh, goddamn. Oh, he's like, let me kill them all. They are bashtets. They are all bashtets. And they must die. Thank you. Okay. Let's go. Right weapons? Yes, you do. There you go. Hey. Good job, team. Maybe I should add some of his movies to uh, future movie polls. I think those would be fun. Make for a good time. Good reviews, chat. Perhaps even good commentaries. 
remember really just liking RPD. <laughs> I remember that was like, yeah, this is an awful movie. Was that the movie that, like, like Brian Reynolds said, like, okay, after this one, like, I can't make any more bad movies anymore? <laughs> Look at him now, Chase. He's like a billionaire. Good for him. Thank you. Thanks. De yep. The, the Deadpool broke the streak. Yeah. Reynolds. Ryan Reynolds talks about like my career was in really major trouble. Which I thought was you know him very being very candid. He made a lot of flops. Before Deadpool. Oh shit. Tali Garris is fighting against those walls. Doing a great job. And his gin. Yeah, didn't he make like six hundred million dollars off of that? Like he sold it, but he also owns it still. It's weird. He owns like the most shares. I forget what it is or the percentage of the company. He's a he's he's a billionaire. I know that. He's done very. And he owns Mint Mobile. He has done very well for himself. Where the fuck are these guys popping up from? Oh yeah, it was a trap. It was a trap, chat. That's what it was. They're trying to bamboozle us. Well, it didn't work. Now it didn't. You know, I, I, that's right. I think I come out of here and I'm like, yeah, 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 yeah. That's what it was. Yeah, they're jamming us now. Sons of bitches. Thankfully, I'm pretty fucking powerful at this point. So, pretty much run through most of these enemies, no problem. Got him. We got him. I think we're pretty good. Yeah, I think when we like exit this place, I think that's what happens. We exit this place and uh, we get the next base. Yeah. You need at least level twenty, I think, for the max level for uh, import for ME two. Uh oh, I'll get it. I'll get it. I'm, uh, I think, uh, what level am I, am I at right now? I'm level 25. I think I'll be able to do it. I feel like I will be able to, because I still got to do, I, there's, uh, there's several other, I mean, I'm going to level up after these missions. Um, oh yeah, I'm going to level up in, uh, very, very quickly. Yeah, very quickly. Um, I'm trying to think. I need, I need, uh, 70 more XP. I, I'll, I'll be able to get it. I'll get the max thing, probably level 28. Because I still got to do Vermeer. I still got to do the Citadel again. Citadel Lockdown. I still got to do Ilos. Of course, the the last mission. And I still have some other um, side quests. Bring down the, 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 the Sky DLC. So I'll be good. I did, I did miss... Uh, I think there's a couple other quests. I... Oh, shit. Damn, all right. Take it. Oh, shit, 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 shit. A lens flare. Strength, the glare off your helmet, girl. Monster. Tally. That must be a message from the primary gas base. Oh we my god. To lock on to its location and take them out. Okay. <laughs> that was funny. All right. How oh, did my fucking ship? Did it get blasted here? Got knocked out. Boom. I gotta sell some more crap. Tally's a JJ Abrams. Yes, yeah, she is. <laughs> Tally. Uh, I'm so close to upgrading again. It's got contra and snipers for say command all that good stuff. All good stuff, chat. Stuff. Yes. So good. Yeah. I'm gonna go down the basement here. We're gonna sell some crap. It's gonna be great. Everyone's gonna have a great time. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Where can I? Okay. 
go to Garrison Locker and see if I have any uh, better weapons for you. Gar Ooh, actually, uh, I should probably check to see if that might be better for me. Um, let me go ahead and go to myself first. The first thing you should do. Crossfire. Not as... I don't think do as much damage. Oh, interesting. I hate it. Uh, no, I, want my, I want my other weapon back. Where's my other weapon breaker? I want that back. Yes, thank you very much. Uh, let's see what else we have here. Katana. Um. Inland Sulkov. Much better weapon. Much better. Good. Oh, shit. I gotta get some better. Uh, I don't know. Use my shotgun, but. It's for hell of it. I'll do it. Directionless. Ooh. Ooh. I'll rock that shit. I need a better pistol. Do I? Oh. Fuck. Razor. I know I hate it. Whatever. you, Garrus? I'll give you a good weapon now. Crossfire. Give you this. Give you a crossfire, Garrus. There you go. You can have that, buddy. Give you a better sniper rifle. Oh, yeah, you can get a better sniper in there, Garrus. I know you. Hell of mine. There you go. You'll like that, chap. Phoenix. <laughs> Alright, we gotta sell some crap. Ben, what was news? What news you get? A portal movie's happening. For what? Wow! Wow, that'll be cool. Let's Who's directing? Do they? Do we know? Bet, that'd be great for Eight Bit Crumbs. We'll definitely talk about that on Eight Bit Crumbs this week, chat. No question. No question. That's really cool. Oh, gee, Abrams, is he producing it? And you report movie still in development. Oh. Oh, this is now 2013. So they're just... They're just saying, it's gonna happen. Interesting. Oh, ads. Huh. Warner Bros. making it? Oh, I'm interested. I'm interested, chat. Let's see what that's all about. We gotta sell all this fucking shit. I got so much crap I don't want. Alright, let's do it. <clears throat> let's go down the list, chat. Just select all this stuff. Kessler, sell all junk. Get a lot of money on that. Nice. That's six million credits. Very easy to break this economy. All right, let's go. Get back up. Do that Geth mission, chat. Let me just see how that's gonna work. I'm curious about it. World's a great game. I gotta play Portal 1 and 2 on stream someday. Make for a great streaming series. So, lens flare, lens flare, nostalgia, nostalgia, more lens flare. Things that don't make sense, probably. JJ, maybe somewhere's going, oh. Oh, Lord. And we gotta go here. Grissom. Oh, yeah. I'll see after, uh, what's, what, Grissom, what's, what's, what's her name? That's right, that's right, Benda. That's right, the hell out of here, Brenda. Oh, yeah, another little turning thing. And we got Zaharix. It's a cool name. Zaharix, chat. Get that right there. Got our Grissom moving fast. I'm trying to. This will probably be the last mission of the night. The Geth Incursion mission is the longest side mission in the game. Uh, there's a couple other ones out here that I definitely miss. I'm going to look up and we'll do them tomorrow. E3, yeah, E3 is going to be fun this year. Got a lot of stuff. 
That's happening this year, right? Is that E3 happening? Be good for 8-bit crumbs. Looking forward to the announcement. Not so much watching the ceremony, but, you know, the stage show. Oh, man. Yes. Soul Club. The one has. You gotta be careful here. Oop, let's go. Elder Scrolls 6. We know they're working on it. I'm hoping that we'll see Wolfenstein, uh, whatever the, the proper third entry is in the series. Looking forward to that with Bethesda. That'd be fun. Oh, we'll see what's happening, or at least they announced, but I'm guessing we'll... Oh, Outer Worlds is not Bethesda. Outer Worlds is, um, um, Obsidian. I mean, they're both owned by Microsoft now. But we can always see that. It's true. I'd be all for that. I would not be shocked if they're doing a, uh... Yeah, they're definitely doing Outer Worlds, so that last game... Uh, I, I played that game. That's on my YouTube channel chat. I played that. That was fun. Anomaly, debris. Okay, let's go this way. Let's go. I still have to finish the Dragonborn DLC in Skyrim chat. Idris, the sneaky cat daddy, will return one day. Will return one day, chat. I'm looking at those movies he's only produced and not direct himself. I, I'm, I'm, I, I think Mission Impossible 3 is an excellent movie. I think Mission Impossible 3 is great. I think the first Star Trek movie he did was really good. And I like The Force Awakens a whole lot. Again, like, you know, adding like a really great villain to film somewhere Hoffman to that movie was an inspired choice on his part. They really brought the movie together, in my opinion. Like, that's what that series was lacking, like a good villain. They really haven't had a good villain since Phil Summer Hoffman. Beep bop, beep boop. The yeah, uh, Turtles meet the Avengers or no? I imagine so. Imagine they'll, you know, they'll meet up. At one point. We'll find out. I mean, the Guardians met the Avengers. What was that Wolfenstein movie that we never going to get? I, you know what? I wanted to like, I wanted to like, uh, excuse me, I wanted to like Overlord more. I, I enjoyed the film. I just had, a, I, I really didn't like a lot of the side characters. I thought Wyatt Russell was quite good in the movie. He, he was like all, all the only one of the cast. I'm like, okay, I, I get this guy. Everyone else, I'm like, eh, I don't. I didn't care for anyone else really. Overlord? No, I'm not. I, I imagine this, yeah. I'll give it a second chance, but I was so excited for that movie. Oh, it looks like, it looks like Wolfenstein. It looks great. And I was like, huh. I was kind of underwhelmed by the film. I'd probably give it like a matinee. And I was like, oh, this is going to be easy, full price. And I was like, eh. They're doing a Van Helsing movie? I didn't know they were doing a Van Helsing movie. I had no idea. Let's take that. All right, chat. I think we got to go over this base now. Boom! Destination. But just never named this movie that goes uh, past Low Rental for me. I feel like he's just never ready. You didn't really, you didn't like Mr. Possible 3? I think I think I think Mission Impossible 3 is still the best Mission Possible. I think that's a high full price film. I really enjoyed that film a lot. Not really improved upon my two, but that's about it. Ah. Man. Alright, teach their own. See, I think MI2 is like. That's definitely the worst Mission Possible movie. Newsy Ducky! Have a great evening! Thank you for stopping by the stream. Appreciate all the support. Oh shit. Shit, 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 Mount 
just a local terrain, right? <laughs> Got him. Excuse me, it's supposed to not up here yet. Oh, shit. I missed! How'd I fucking miss? It's right in front of me! Got him. Hey! There's the level up I was looking for. Hello, you. Got him. Nice. Very nice. Oh, yeah, we'll get, definitely get to level 28. It would be perfect for Mass Effect uh, 2. Have that all carry over. Very exciting. Uh, let me go ahead and take all that. Thank you very much. A little squat, squeed. My squeed. Sniper rivals. We'll start there. So one, two. So I have what? Uh, 27, 28, 29, 30. 14, 2 is 8, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So one of these is going to be left off. Uh, might. Hmm. Hmm. Think about it. Anyway, uh, I'll do assault training. We'll keep going. Assault training with Garrus. Tali, the Talster. First aid all the way. And, uh, let's see here. Damp, increase the explosion radius of your tech proximity mines, shuts down enemy tech and biotic abilities. Hacking. Charge your tech proximity mines more quickly. Hmm. Grants the eye hacking ability, which, uh, makes artificial enemies go berserk and attack each other. Uh. I'll go with damping. Do that check. Now let's go in the base. Woo! Here's your, uh, structure mind to me defies logic. Let's <laughs> Let's, um, uh, uh, let's make a villainous cadet who could possibly be kicked out of Starfleet, like a captain. <laughs> no, I, I, it's, I really like Star Trek 2009. I think it's a really fun movie. Uh, but it's definitely more of a Star Wars film than a Star Trek movie. I even, I admit that. But I really like that film. But I get why Star Trek fans would not like it. I totally get it. You know, uh, uh, Chris Pine is more Han Solo than Captain Kirk. <laughs> Jesus Christ, that's a big boy. Oh boy, oh boy, he's coming right towards me. Guys are right under primes for being a pain in the ass. As the laugh gas falls, you hear music from across the room. On the monitor, our Corian stands before a hushed crowd, warbling a mournful a cappella of worlds and innocent lost. The record songs dispatch the gap the worlds behind the Percy's Veil, which is where he shuts down. Hey, -o. so good. I think uh, it's part of Tali's mission. Just a famous, famous welcome to the stream. Hope you're doing well. Good to see you. Got some probably the last thing we'll do. Oh, here it is. I think it's here. It's where Tali gets her little thing. She'd be so happy. Discover a number of encrypted uh, Geth data files in the proper hands. They could reveal much about the evolution of the Geth since the banishment of the Quarians. Oh, yeah, she'll love that. So I'll give that to Tali. She'll be all about it. It'll probably be the last thing I do tonight, Jim. Chat. I'll do some songs, um, I'll do some songs tomorrow on stream. I'm gonna try to start a little earlier. It's been doing so much, so much stuff. Excessive for asking. Good night, guys. Hope everyone uh, gets a great rest. Uh, you too. Thank you. It's been great to have you here. Hope you enjoyed yourself. Welcome to the Revenite community. Let's head back down, chat. Hey. Oddly enough, Star Trek Beyond is the one I like the most, but faint praise is the movie isn't very good either. Yeah, I don't I don't I don't like Beyond. I think Beyond was the worst one of that uh of that trilogy that they they, they, they did. I think um Data Darkness is okay. I think it's fine. 
But I, I have a lot of issues with um, Beyond. I still think the first one's the best. And the first one has issues. Like, Nero's... I don't understand why Nero's so mad. <laughs> I'm preventing genocide. What? How? <laughs> like, that doesn't make any sense. Like, that is, uh, that's like, yep, that's an apt criticism. I'm preventing genocide. I don't think you are, Nero. But, you know, teach their own, of course. Whip. Whip. Face Off is great. Face Off is a great movie. I agree with that. We're going to give this to the Tallster, my future space waifu. Hey, girl. I'm going to go ahead and save. Verhoeven. Yeah, my favorite Verhoeven movies. Uh, uh, Robocop, definitely number one. It's my favorite. Then Total Recall. Then I'd say Starship Troopers. My three favorites. You. Shepard, I need to talk to you. Of course, girl. It's important. Anything for you, Tali. Anything Something wrong? You. you know the data you took from Yeah, you were with me the whole time. I remember. The information you uploaded to yep. Alliance Control? I want to copy it. I understand. Sure. You want to bring this data back to the migrant with me? Those files so you can miss this uh, little side mission of Tali? efforts to understand the gap. It could be the key but it helps. Helping us reclaim our they, uh, they that next time you see her, she actually is one of the first things you reference in, in when you see her in Mass Effect 2. Let me get that. You think you can use this information to destroy your enemy? Not right away. We will need to study it. It could take years, but it will give us new insight into how the gap has changed wee. and evolved over the past centuries. All right. Go ahead. Make a copy. Let's start. My people, I owe you a great debt, one I can never repay. The only thing I can offer in return is what you already have. My solemn promise to Didn't you also point out in your review that Beyond Bros. a lot of mess? I think Justin even said it was an influence. I don't, I don't even remember what I said in that review for that movie. I have no idea. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Possibly. <laughs> I mean, Star Trek, um... I mean, oh, Mass Effect borrows a lot from Star Trek. They borrow from each other. Good. I never wanted anything more. Yay! Thank you. Yay! You're welcome, Tali. We did it, chat. We did it. I don't even remember. I, I, I barely even remember that I did a review for that film. That was when I was on one of us.net. Some about giant sword ships that attack and shape shift all at once. I don't remember. I remember that. I remember that thing. Well, they were like the collectors. They like they were like the collectors in a way. But I, I don't remember. I don't remember what I said. It's been so long. Mm -mm. Boom. Both that chat. I gotta go. I gotta get going, everybody. Beastie Boys, Beastie Boys say sabotage. I'm like, I'm like, all right. <laughs> That's when, when that happened. The movie I was like, okay. <laughs> oh, like, well, that that was. I'm like, all right. <laughs> That's the one. I was like, I'm, I wasn't liking the movie for the most part. I thought Idris Elba. They did him dirty. I thought he was the weakest villain in the franchise. I just the makeup they had under. He's an interesting character. I like the idea. I mean. Of this Starfleet captain who's like, we got fucking abandoned. Fuck you people. I really like that idea. But I just didn't think they used him well. The whole, I don't understand. Like, he used the machine. He turned different races. I'm like, what the hell's going on? None, none of that movie made any sense to me. It was just, it was just, it was odd. It was very odd, to say the least. But, chat, thank you for joining me for all these Mass Effect shenanigans. This has been so much fun.